All right, let's uh, let's let's just jump right in. I'll put my my mouse on the charger. I'm really excited about this, y'all. If you're not familiar, another crab's treasure is a crab-based game that is a Souls-like. So it is a crab game in the style of Dark Souls, made possible by the Neo Cascadia Documentary Association. Oh, what we're getting word a little movie time. Mind when you think of the Earth. For some, that word might be beautiful. Grab a goop of some snack might and enjoy this documentary. Others might say the world is hateful or evil or unstable or full of shit. But above all else, the word that best describes our world is resilient. Against the odds, time and time again, story. creatures adapt to make the most of their given environment. Some learn to feed on others, stealing their vitality for their own. Some become scavengers, Fresh. living off what strangers leave behind. And others still, as we will soon see. <laughs> Good transition. Would prefer to be simply left alone. Would anyone in the chat prefer to be simply left alone? Hands up. <laughs> Raise your hand. Ah! Oi! Go away! No one's home! Sir, please open up. Loan shark? Oh, uh, <laughs> you're not a bird. Sir, are you the owner of this residence? You mean my shell? Uh, yeah, it's mine. Do you like it? I represent the Royal Duchy of Slacktide, which has recently annexed the territory surrounding and including this tide pool. I'm here to inform you that you have outstanding taxes that date back and upwards of 10 tides. If you are presently unable to pay this balance, the Duchy will claim your home until you- uh, Hold on, I've got some questions. First of all, uh, what's a Duchy? <laughs> also, taxes? Okay. <laughs> So basically, the Duchess of Slacktide owns this whole area now. And she puts a lot of effort into keeping it safe. So everyone who benefits from that has to abide by her rules and pay up once per tide. There's still plenty of birds here. I don't know if it's really safe. Look, kid, I don't have time to argue <laughs> political nuances here. I've got a lot of tax evaders to get through. <laughs> you gotta pay up right now or I'm gonna have to repo your property. Got it? Okay, okay. I think I've got a hard kelp or two around here somewhere. Oh, okay, move legs, move camera. Makes sense. I've got a dodge roll. Perfect. This looks like heart kelp. Why is take? Okay. Found your stash of heart kelp. Everyone loves these delicious heart kelp pods, so they're often used for trading. Eating just one of these makes you feel restored. Are these like Estes flasks? I gotta hold down. Acknowledge knowledge. Hopefully this is enough for taxes. I didn't know this game was gonna be about taxes. <laughs> is this some child drowning while p playing loan shark with a crab? I Maybe? I don't know who's wielding the shark toy. <laughs> what a political commentary. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That, can I go elsewhere? Do I ironically die if I go in the water? I don't have a jump move. I think... I don't think I can go anywhere. I think I got, just got to roll with Mr. Lone Shark. If you don't call yourself Tamatoa, you're off the squad. You think I'm pandering to Moana fans? Alright, let's talk to Mr. Mr. Lone Shark. <laughs> Set up a shell core. Oh, I should have done that. Missed my my shell corporation opportunity. <laughs> I actually agree with my husband for once. <laughs> well, everybody, uh, mark this day on your calendars. It finally happened. Hey, I know this isn't much, but what the shell is this? They're heart kelp pods. Don't tell me you don't even like heart kelp. I hope you're joking. No one uses these dumb things as money anymore. The ocean's moved to the trash standard now. Trash, you got it? Trash, you got it? <laughs> I think that I think we're about to learn the opposite logic. 
<laughs> trash? So like, no pearls either? No shiny pirate coins? That's right, none of that crap. So you better find some bread clips or some sauce packets back there. I'm losing my darn patience. Look, if if you're just gonna give me a couple more tides, if, if you just give me a couple more tides. All right, I've heard enough. Say goodbye to your shell, idiot. <laughs> wait, wait. <gasps> Not my shell. He's left me in the nude. Oh, crab, 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 crab. Crab, crab, crab. <laughs> the shark and Zeki are loosely related distant cousins. <laughs> Is he guilting us into cleaning the oceans or does he want the ocean to be messier so that he gets more profit, right? Crab, crab, crab. All right, I'm nude. Oh, he's over there. <laughs> I got the anime arms. <laughs> Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, I can jump now. That's exciting. Nobody look at my nude crab booty. I found you, nude crab booty. Wait. <laughs> you can't do this to me, man. How am I supposed to stay safe from all the birds and stuff around here? Not my problem. You want your shell back? You better go get a job and pay up. I hear they're always hiring in the reef. The reef? Isn't it super busy there? I don't want to talk to people. Mood, 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 mood. Neutral tell Tay. Bellarum, Bellarum, hit him. Yeah. Thanks for bonking him, Bellarum. <laughs> you think I have money for these taxes? <laughs> I found you, new crab booty. <laughs> Again, really not my problem. I don't care where you get the trash from, but I'm keeping this until you do. See you later. Hold crab, 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 crab. <laughs> I like that he just says his name instead of crap. Uh yeet myself into the ocean. I was worried for a moment that that was the wrong move. Alright, here we go. Hold A while jumping to swim. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Underwater platforming. I don't know why I agreed to play this game. I hate underwater levels of all kinds. Yeah, there we go. This platforming does feel a bit like a uh, slime rancher, honestly. I think I'm gonna assume these are climbable, right? Yeah, <laughs> my little crab claws. Pick up. Bread claw. <laughs> <laughs> a small chunk. Oh, that goop bot. I was like, what? Why would I replace something in that paragraph? <laughs> a small chunk of plastic in the shape of a crab's claw. Maybe it has some value. Trade it in for 250 microplastics. Acknowledge knowledge. I'm literally trading in microplastics. Excuse me. <laughs> like when I run, I, I do the airplane arms. Oh, hey, it's another crab. Excuse me, sir. Uh, Did you see a really tall shark pass by carrying a super awesome dope looking shell? <laughs> did I write this character? Whoa, whoa. Work? That's what I'm trying to not do. That's why I got to catch up with worthless. Now I can truly loaf around. <laughs> Carl Johan, welcome in. How's it going? An honest loan shark. I got it. I got it. I'm shell shocked that he would do that. I know. So everyone's so mean to me. Also, why is this guy's name Moaning Crab? Holy crab! What's wrong with your eyes? Have you been sleeping enough? Or oh God, get away from me! Oh God! Uh, oh, he's got friends. Can I fight? Is there a fight button? Oh, there's so many. Can I find a weapon? Oh my goodness, there's so many. All right, okay, all right, it's fine. Not not worried, never worried. Ah! They're popping out of the ground, like, like daisies. I'm out of here. 
The music is actually like, it was kind of tense there for a second. Sheesh, I think I lost him. I knew the ocean could be sketchy, but I had no idea it was this bad. Thank you. I, I have two Mulan references and that's one of them. I appreciate your acknowledgement. Uh, let's go towards the big shiny DNA looking thing, I guess. Oh wait, is that? Huh. I, I guess it couldn't hurt to have a way to defend myself. We got our first weapon. This thing seems like it could do a little damage. If anyone else attacks me, I guess I'll poke him with the pokey bit. Is this a Game of Thrones reference? Is this a stick him with the pointy end reference? Might as well give this bad boy a few practice swings. You found a rusty fork. Press right bumper to swing the fork. Acknowledge knowledge. I feel, oh, okay. We got it. We got a, uh, a light attack. We have a stab if we charge. I can, okay, I can defend. I have a, a, a block. I have, okay, so I have, I have dodge roll. Oh, if I dodge roll into attack, I do a little spin. Oh, wait. Ooh. Now I'm walking on broken glass. Focusing on enemies. Here we go. Special attack tetanus. Oh, no. I've never played this before. It came out like a week or two ago, and this is my first time. It is, it is a Souls-like, though, so it's similar to Dark Souls. I've got gadgets and gizmos aplenty. True, true, true. Press right stick to focus on enemies, keeping the camera locked to them. This is really useful for fighting, so don't forget about it. Don't forget about it. Oh, it goes into... <laughs> it goes into widescreen when you focus on enemies. Oh. Okay, his corpse just dissolved, so that's something. I've got who's it's and what's it's galore. <laughs> no, we watched the trailer for this on stream a couple weeks ago. Zaya, welcome in. How's it going? Hit him with the dingle hopper. Yeah. The rusty dingle hopper. Correct. Correct. <laughs> you want thingamabobs? I'll show you thingamabobs. I've got 20. And I'm willing to stab you with all of them. Tap B right as an enemy attacks to dodge out of the way. The timing takes some practice, but dodging successfully can avoid most damage. I tell you what. Look how he's holding the fork. Hee hee hee. Goodbye, Mr. Crab. Mr. Moaning Crab. Looking to Kina. I've uh, I've never heard of it. What is Kina? Can I break this? Yeah. All right. So bottles are like um, like crates in Dark Souls, where I want to destroy all of them. <laughs> For the violence of it, you know? Oh, there's like a, an item behind that? Some kind of crystal? Ooh. I got crystals. Do you think I can sell these? Jen, Jen, welcome in. Mighty Sushi, welcome in. How's it going? Kina Bridge of Spirits. Is it is it a Souls-like? What is it a game? Is it a movie? Yeah. I am a crab. Bam. <laughs> Whoa, what's that thing? The currents start getting warm close to this little platform. It's kind of comfy. Did somebody pee here? <laughs> Maybe I could rest my feet here for a little while. Oh, okay, it's a, it's a bonfire. It's a crab-based bonfire. Touch current. Lovely. Moon snail shell found. Moon snail shells. Touch these glowing currents to restore a long forgotten moon snail shell, which you can rest in to restore your health. If you're slain, you'll revive at the last one you stayed at, so be sure to activate every one you can. Gotcha. So I just get to like, it's like a motel. It's like the cozy cone from Cars. Wait, is it actually Pixar Dark Souls or, or is it just in the style? Is it just a cutesy style? <laughs> oh, is this included in Game Pass? I should have looked because I definitely purchased it. <laughs> Whoops. 
Cave of Respite. We're in the shallows. I realize the only time y'all see me here is when I'm not doing good. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry to hear about that sushi. Cutesy style, but souls like gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. When you see, it, you'll understand. Okay, I gotcha. There, I know there's also like an anime souls one that uh, Jaren played through. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, Sush. I I hope that uh, <clears throat> I hope that that things go as well as they can for for you and your family. I know that's a tough thing to work through. Microplastics and leveling up. The power present in moon snail shells will allow you to purge microplastics from yourself, gaining strength in the process. Beautiful. I love that. However, certain folks might be interested in trading for your extra micro microplastics, so you might want to consider saving some. Okay, so microplastics are souls, is what I'm hearing. Acknowledge knowledge. I have 75, and I need 300 for my next level up. Health decreases the damage your shell takes and improves resist. Oh, resistance. Okay. Hack. MSG? <laughs> Enhances, wait, it's actually MSG though. Enhances damage of umami based attacks. Code vein, yeah, that's the anime one. Yeah, 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 you got it. I, I've been thinking about it lately and like the, the kind of brand that I've I've accidentally fallen into like a accidentally right is I play I play cozy games and I play hard games I haven't been playing anything in between it's mostly been like the very cute and the very comforting and the stuff that kicks your butt into next week <laughs> I'm happy to lean into that though I'm gonna process and they have said I made affiliate oh I did see that hey congratulations on affiliate status and that's good. It sounds like that might be a good like distraction for you. Not not temporary distraction. Not the distraction should be forever. Because we are all basically just shells full of microplastics by now. That's what I'm told at least. But I get to purge them from my body and get stronger. How do I do this in real life? Yeah, right. This feels like the the weird intersection of of the cozy cute game and the hard game. I'm interested to see how tough it's going to be. Okay. We can we can leave here. Shell collection. As soon as I get this back, everything can go back to normal. There are 69 shells you can get. <laughs> of course there are. I think I actually wrote this game. I'm not certain. Y'all, if you're not following Sush, go follow Sush. Th there you are. Wow, you're awful persistent. I think I've been pretty clear with you, kid. This shell's the property of the Duchess now. If you want it back, take it up with her, not me. My work is done here. Yo, Gerudo Waifu. Nice. Also, Biohazard, thank you for the 69 nice biddies. This is very nice. Also, if anybody's interested, Goose is having a little snack right now. Also, there's a sippy cup next to the cat food. Come on, man. There's got to be something I can do. Yeah, now that you mention it, I can think of something. You can lick my freaking ventral fins and stop bothering me. <laughs> Later, kid. Ah, uh, this guy. Lick my freaking ventral fins. <laughs> You can't do that on Twitch. That is TOS for sure. The Shallows. There's a flip-flop. And s lots of cigarette butts. That makes sense. I believe, and I could be wrong, but I believe cigarette butts are the number one most littered thing in the world. Crabs, 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 Oyster shells. Oyster shells. Crabs, 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 crabs. Yeah, he's fake as heck, right? Purple Blur, welcome in, and thank you for the 12 crab biddies. <laughs> crab biddies on a crab day. In my crab shirt. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't see crabs, your type crabs, leaving the type pool too crabs, often. Crabs, <laughs> Nomad! Crabs, 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 
crabs, crabs, crabs, crabs, crabs, crabs, crabs, oyster shells, oyster shells, crabs, 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 crabs. No man, thank you for the 12 crab biddies and welcome in. How's it going? Goop wrote this game confirmed. I feel like I did. I feel like this is right up my comedy alley. Yeah, well, I didn't have a choice. Can you tell me what's going on here? I heard there's like a duchess in charge now. Yep, sure is. Real piece of work. Takes all my hard-earned microplastics every time just for existing around here. <laughs> Biohazard, let me, let me get to a good place and then we'll do that stretch. Please don't show us your comedy alley. What? Why not? Why not? <laughs> uh, very short CVS receipt. <laughs> and what do I see for it? Nothing. Just keeps building up her castle and hiring more soldiers to defend it. Oh, that that's cool. W where can I find her? I think she has something of mine. Pal, just look around for a moment and you'll probably figure it out. Or did you miss that huge castle in the distance? Oh, okay, great. I'll head over there. Hopefully she can get rid of my taxes for me. Oh, I see how it is. You're some kind of freeloader, are you? <laughs> Bet you think you can skirt your taxes while the rest of us keep this society together, do ya? You just said you hermit crabs are all the same. Work in the shells the rest of us work so hard to create with our own mantles. You ought to have stayed in your tide pool, small fry. Hey, I never did anything to you, man. Yeah? Well, how about I do something to you? Ah! All right. Let's do this. Oh, I'm, I one-hit murdered him. Oh, I can steal a shell. Why does everyone here in this place try to kill me? This shell doesn't even fit! All right, calm down, Krill. This is the most dangerous situation you've been in since seagull breeding season. Oh, yikes. <laughs> but all you gotta do is make it to that castle, like the rude snail said. It sounds like that duchess controls the taxes around here, so I bet the shark took my shell to her. I'm sure once I tell her what's going on, this can all be resolved and I can go right back to sleep. What a waste of time. There's no way I'm fitting in this thing. I guess my only choice is to head to that castle. All right, let's take a moment and, uh, and do a stretch here. All right, good stretch. I see on this menu, I have an option to equip a shell. I also have adaptations and stowaways. Are you sure I can't wear this? All right, let's follow the cigarette microplastic road. Oh yeah, the jogging stra it, it really is no joke. It does, it makes me feel Oh, I just took a free hit there. Yeah. The music is so relaxed for what that is. I got a barbed hook. A weapon designed to reel and prey at long distance. In combination with a sturdy piece of string, even massive targets might be drawn in if struck at a weak point. So can I turn that into a weapon later? Oh, there's also fashion. You see that? Plastic poncho. I love fashion. <laughs> I think the horns were fish hooks. There's some kind of item up here. Another bread claw. That's a, a lighter. Bickless. <laughs> Did y'all know that Bic in, uh, in, as in Bic lighters uh, is short for Bickless? <laughs> Confirmed here. I did make a grill is short for grillium joke yesterday. So I'm uh, I'm really scared that they stole from my subconscious to write this this uh this game. Hello. Rock and roll. Bickleus pattern. <laughs> so fetch. <laughs> An another poncho. That's right. Star Wars also does the poncho gaming thing. All right. I should not get distracted and just uh, try to find every hidden thing. Probably. I guess we'll f we'll follow up where it wants us to go. We'll be good and follow the intended path. Although, the road does go over here. 
there are just fish hooks hanging down from the ceiling. Do you think that I can go up to the surface with them? Please, Bickleus was my father. <laughs> Niskelis Bickleus. Oi. Oh, wow. I dodged that and he still like hit like a truck. Or not dodged, I blocked it. So, apparently, I need a shell real bad. I have no defense. Ooh, he had some heart heart kelp. Okay, so the heart kelps must be my heal. I see them in the lower right there. I have 142 microplastics. I need 300 to level up. So do I just go ham sandwich on some fools? Oh, ho, ho. yeah, he's definitely just got... Ow! He's definitely just got fish hooks tied to him as horns. Okay, 25 microplastics from him. Heart kelp? I don't even know who you... F Wait, who you... You know who you are following the game? What? I'm confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. Blood star limb. A severed limb of a blood star easily regenerated by the host creature. Collect four or more to increase vitality. Oh. Ow! That was so rude of you. Why did the crab cross the road? That That's what that popsicle stick said, but there's no answer. Can I? Oh, I can. He is a tax fugitive. <laughs> it's incredible. Game of the year. Game of the year. Ow. Oh. Okay, hold up. They're not cutting you any breaks in this one. Oh, my goodness. Why is this guy so much stronger than the other ones? They're like, no, bruh. For real, you gotta dodge. <laughs> Can I butt stab fish? Can I butt stab crabs? Yeah. There doesn't seem to be a stamina bar, which I'm fine with, I believe. Ugh. Oi. Oh, okay, I see. It's it's jump. Jump attack for the spin. There we go. We are so close to 300 and a level up. Thread claw. Come here. Ah ha ha. Beautiful. Do fish have butts? I mean, that... That is a question. As, as Bingo Healer would say, that is a question. <laughs> they, have, they have poop holes at least. <sighs> oh my goodness. Okay. I want that crystal thing over there. There's a bonfire that way, I see. But I'm willing to fight the law before I get there. I am out of heals. So maybe it would be smart to not go for this crystal thing, but I kind of want to go for the crystal thing, you know? There's the big castle. There's just, this ocean is so dirty. We should do something about this. I think so? Maybe that, maybe that's what it is. Small chunk of plastic, trade it, trade it in for 250 microplastics. Who do I trade it to though? Is there like a merchant? Cause it wouldn't crush like in my inventory like that. Ah! Ow! Whoa! Okay, fighting two guys at the same time is not fair. We have been over this, games. There we go. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. <laughs> I think we just go to the bonfire. <laughs> Fish buttless. For the most part, humans are the only ones with actual butts because we walk upright on two legs and our butts hold the muscles we need to do so. Oh, smart. I mean, that makes sense, yeah. I've never thought about how valuable valuable my butt is. Nice catch there, Bellar. I'm on that Celester. Celester? Hardly know her. 
Moon snail shell found. All right. Can level up. Uh, should I just do more attack damage? Or <laughs> I, do I increase my MSG? It's a bonfire. Turn the lights out. I'm burning everything. Never mind. <laughs> you can anus stab the fish. You're right, Purple Blur. That does sound so much worse. <laughs> we did it. We purged the microplastics from my body. We're going to really be leaning into uh, steel drums on the soundtrack, I think. I really need a shell. And I really don't know where to get one. There, that's just a 9-volt battery. Oi! Fishman Jones! I do more damage now. How you like that? How you like me now? I would have gotten more health, but health doesn't do damage, so why would I get it, you know? <laughs> Ooh, mommy. This is a PBR can. F physical based rendering? Is that what it says? Physic physically based rendering. PBR? Fantastic. Made in Unity, 6.9% alcohol by volume. <laughs> the, this game has not missed yet. <laughs> Incredible. Absolutely stellar. Physically based rendering made in Unity. Oh, that is a crustacean with a spear. Or a lance, I guess. Hey guys. Halt, trespasser! By order of the Duchess, all suspicious characters are to be barred from slack tide. Suspicious? I thought I looked pretty harmless. Downright adorable, huggable even. <laughs> Perhaps you speaketh truth, vagrant, but I shalt ne'er grantest thou entry twixt these mighty gates while thy loins remain ungirdled. <laughs> I'm getting shamed for my ungirdled loins. <laughs> it's, a, it's a straw with a lid going through it. They're both straws. One is a reusable straw, though. Ex shucking, excuse me? <laughs> Dude, take a hint. She's saying you're naked. <laughs> oh, yeah. I guess I hadn't thought about that. Is that important these days? I feel like society's really moved on without me while I've been practicing self-care. All right, okay, okay, all right. Okay. Sure seems like it. The Duchess would have our heads if we let you in wearing nothing but a rag. Fret not, little crustacean. Nearby to the east lieth a repository laden with complimentary garmentry. Face the gate and turn right. You'll find a charity center where you can get something to wear. Our captain is stationed there right now, I think. Great guy. He'll get you sorted. Sounds cool. And then you'll let me in? Assuming nothing sketchy comes up in your background check. Sure. I have to do a background check? Ah, uh, all those crimes I did back in the 60s are going to come back to haunt me. Their weapons really suck. Boo. Oi. Fish. Get crabbed. Get forked? I should have said get forked. That's a much better joke. Oh. Oh, just press the button late there. I do have heals again, which is very nice. <laughs> you just can't see, I uh, can't unsee Loki. Maybe it's a Loki variant. They really, they really set it up for that quite well. Yeah. Is this a thing I can have? Can I have this? The other guys wear bottle caps. Why can't I? This guy's just got like a ring of wire on his head, like a key ring. 
<laughs> I don't want to get crabbed. Okay, a little one-two punch attack. Is this more heart, heart, heart kelp? Does this improve my permanent supply? Oh no. Ah, well, I'll just heal that. And then pick up some more. Okay, I like that. I like the replenishing heal. I'm gonna try not to call everything what it is in Dark Souls, so I'm gonna try not to call that Estus, but that is what it is. Look at all those butts. Look at those nice ketchup packets. Beautiful. Got another bread claw. This is climbable. Oh, there's a fish guy down there. Oh, and there's more of this up here, which I don't really know what it does still, but it seems good to have. I wish I had a plunge attack. That would be very fun. See you later, Loki fish. A bread claw. Nothing over there. Actually not butts. Look at all these flow <laughs> Oh! Okay, so if you run into pointy things, it hurts. Don't know if y'all knew that, but if you literally walk into something that will stab you, you get stabbed. So I can break glass bottles, but can't do anything to plastic bottles. Heard chef. Vibing on the music. Boop, boop, boop. Uh huh. Wait, wait, they said there was a a place over here where I can get free stuff. Where is that? What is that? Oh, oh, it's a soda. It's a whole soda machine. Let your dreams fizzle. Sweet nothing. Meal replacement sparkling water. Does that look like an enemy? That looks like a crab waiting to wake up. He's got there. You can see the claw and everything. Are the little hearts on the sea with the heal things? Yes. Uh. Okay. <gasps> oh. Soda can. Are they all the same? All medium weight. 30 defense. So I get to just choose whichever flavor I want, is what I'm hearing. I want the green one. Whew! Now I can get to get in to see the Duchess. This shell chafes like heck compared to mine. Who even made this thing? New shell discovered. Found a weird metal shell. Press and hold left bumper to hide inside your shell. Wearing a shell reduces damage taken. Hiding in it will divert all damage to your shell health. Your shelf, if you will. Those pencils are exactly like... Oh, yeah. Like the um, the, the, the beach defense in Norman. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's what... I mean, you're right. Yeah. That's that's exactly what they're styled Whoa, after. Self, uh, oh, God. Is this oh, a boss? God. I'm sorry. Was I supposed to grab a ticket? You think yourself above the law? Kinda, but yeah. The law is not so easily outwitted. By its strength alone, do we rise above the beasts. Uh, I'm really sorry. I'll go to the back of the line, okay? <laughs> you should be so lucky. I'll have your head like I have these other oh. worthless... Oh no. He's just got crabs on pikes. Yep. So we've got a boss fight. I don't know how hard this is going to be. I'm going to give you two minutes to bet all your channel points if you want to. <laughs> 
I do have backup soda shells. That looks great. Enjoy your gamba. <laughs> You've got two minutes to vote on whether or not I will uh, beat this boss on the first try. His name is Nefro, Captain of the Guard. I've never played this game before. I have no clue how strong he is. I have no idea how tough a fight this is. So uh, it's a real, a real blind gamba here. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, they might not like this is the potentially sketchy thing that they mentioned. It's 6k versus 9k. <laughs> I might be actively going to war with this entire this entire society. Oh, shellaportation. Oh, so there's like a, a skill progression too. I love that. Die instantly. Huh? Borderless. Oh, I love that it defaulted to borderless. Incredible. Oh, there is a map. Look at that. And there is a, a lobster, a blue lobster captain. My background check might get tarnished. True. Yeah. <laughs> Small boy just wants to shell back murder's entire kingdom more at 11. Yeah, this is the captain of the guard. And I don't think he's happy with me, if I'm being honest. This music, though. All right, you got like five seconds on the gamba. Good luck. Three, two, one. All right, here we go. Good luck, Nefro, Captain of the Guard. <laughs> oh, oh God, he hit, he hits. Let, let me tell you, the boy be hitting. I'm fish food. Can I get him in the butt? Blue lobsters are a real thing. They're, they're like real rare, right? Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Oh my God. Bellarm, they made your joke. He said, through my blade, his justice sucked. You dare raise your blade against the law. <laughs> Come here. The music's real good, I tell you what. He'll boil me alive. Va who you call in varmint? Unblockable attacks. Some attacks are unblockable aggro attacks, signaled by the aggro symbol that appears above Krill. When you see it, be sure to dodge, run, or jump out of the way. Okay, so this is something that Star Wars also does. Oh! Oh, what? Oh, no. Wait, I'm, I'm on an invisible wall is the problem. That's why I got hit by that. Oh, my shell broke. Oh, oh no. Oh, man. I was trying to find the other shells that I, oh, I got slapped. All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I found a watery grave. Y'all trusted me too much. Will Goop be the boss first try? Nope. Congratulations to everybody who didn't believe in me. <laughs> Congratulations.
You died. When you're slain, you'll drop all the microplastics and your shell, if you had one, in the spot where you died. Be careful when you go to pick them up. If you die again while they're still on the ground, they'll be lost forever. My poor bit. Well, your, your poor channel points. I didn't take actual money from you, I promise. Oh, I just get to recover my junk. Love that. Okay. Well, let's do it again. Now that we know there's an invisible wall, maybe things will go a little bit better. Let's go! Can I wear all of them? Do the different colors count as different shells? I don't believe they do. Alright, I don't think we need to do this again. I think we can just fight him. <laughs> that is the first time I died, yes. This is the first, like, boss. I love that he's like a like a lancer. You know, like he wheels around like he's a horse. You're fish food. I'm fish food. Oh. Took that one to the chin. Gonna heal just in case. <laughs> he skids out. He does go too far on that attack. You go too far, Mr. Lobster. Oh, oh, I dodged backwards on accident. Silly me. This game is like, I'm surprised that it's as difficult as it is. Oh, come on. I didn't let my film. Oh, so that injures my shell as well. How do I, I didn't see the icon that said that that was undodgeable or unblockable. Oh, ow. I'm out of juice. I'm half health. Oh, okay. I saw the icon that time. I'm going to swap into a new shell. This has no, no business being as tricky of a fight as it is. Whoa! Oh, come on. Oh, I'm dead. Yep. That grab attack is brutal. I tell you what. There you go. <laughs> All right, let's do it again. I like that you just start hanging out on a little uh, jellyfish pad. All right. We get our, it's not soda. I mean, it says soda can, but it's a meal replacement sparkling water. Claws off, lawbreaker. Do I think jellyfish come in different flavors? Do you think jam fish come in different flavors? Oh, I dodged way early there. Oh, oh! I panic dodged and got punished. Ah! Well, I was healing. Holy moly! Why is this fight so hard? <laughs> They're not messing around. He's wheeling. He's wheeling. Oh, I died oh, super early. Oh. I'm getting worse. Okay. 
I wonder if it wants me to focus much more on blocking. Because it's giving me like four four shells here. Maybe I should just be way more aggro in my attacks. Ow! Oh, he stomped me! Alright, okay. I feel less bad about dying first time on this. This is hard! This is tricky! Souls like do tend to be hard, but for a first boss, this is actually pretty intense. He just hit me with the uh, the very first part of his charge attack there. At least I recover all my uh, all my stuff. Is there someone that I can sell microplastics to and level up? Maybe maybe that's the solution. Oh, it's all it's all invisible wall. Maybe before I, I take a shell. I mean, I, t I should be able to beat this fight. Where was the, um, where was the most recent? You can't see the, like you can't move the map at all. <laughs> I don't remember where the most recent uh, bonfire was. <laughs> no worries, Bellarum. That that's a big crab with a comb. I right, Bob. Okay, I do no damage to him. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> That man slapped me. Holy moly, out of nowhere, the one hit KO. Sheesh. Well, at least I found the most recent bonfire I was at, you know? Why did the lobster blush? He pissed himself. <laughs> what? <laughs> Incredible. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight some boys. Um, I could put it on the screen. Uh, it might take me half a second. Oh, ah, oh, ah, no. Why, why did I, why did I trust you all? <laughs> I don't, I, I don't want to lose my souls. I can't die here. I don't want to die in here. <laughs> There we go. Whew, that was almost bad. That was almost bad. Okay. Oh, this is it! Yo! This is it! Yeah! Thank you for subbing, that was something really cool to do I couldn't do this if it weren't for awesome folks like you And so I wrote this song, I hope you sing along But let me just assure you, you'll be in my heart the whole month long Yes! 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 Shirley, thank you for the 11 heckin' month resub Please enjoy those cute cat emotes and also the one that is my wife's face I appreciate that so much I'll try not to lose my soul but I might be a little crabby about it. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> it's a crab game. You get it? Um, I'm going to heal up here before we move forward. Oh, um, and songs are at the 10, Nomad. 
so you know. I don't want I don't want anybody to think I'm scamming them. <laughs> I've been doing songs at uh at 10 points for a little while. I think I'm going to go try to like beat up a bunch of dudes. There we go. That was that was good. More of that. <laughs> Oh, oh, you mean just the one that played. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes way more sense. <laughs> I was like, I don't want people to think. Because it used to be five. Whack. Are there more stickers to be won? Uh, no. <laughs> Not this month. That was just a last month thing. I'm worried that all those crabs over there are going to aggro me at the same time and I'm going to die, 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 die. Die, 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 die. Did I just like, was I supposed to explore a lot more and I just went too hard on the storyline at first? Cause there's like, it seems a good deal more to explore over here. <laughs> I'm not supposed to admit that there's not more stickers. What am I supposed to admit? Tax evasion? I can't believe this, that this, game is actually about tax evasion. T is currently driving to another city. She should be there right around now. But if she was here, she'd have some things to say. Skamaz train. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm here to skamaz people. Back ruffians. Oh, Vern. Back, I say! You there! I don't suppose you'd lend a claw to a fellow in need? I dare say I'll die for sure if you don't. Okay, yeah. Let's uh, fight some dudes. Let's fight some boys. Let's fight some boys. Yeah, T is a professional loan shark, so it's pretty offensive to her. <laughs> Have you not done your taxes yet? <laughs> You're like a, more than a month overdue at this point. <laughs> Although I'm told that it's not hard to file for an extension. Crab. You see, I'm a hermit crab. I don't like people. Fine swordsmanship, my boy. I dare say these ruffians have become bolder and bolder as of late, but that's just life on the frontier. How exciting. Why not move away if it's so dangerous? And give up this prime land the Duchess offered me? No way, Moray. <laughs> What's the latest time of day you'll drink a coffee? It depends on the day. It depends on what I have to do the next day. But usually like 4 p.m. Not that I, I'll like, I'll sometimes have like a soda with dinner. Did the extension and had everything done two days after the day except my mileage. Oh, I got you. I got you. Seems like you're really trying to claw your way to victory over the lobster. I really am. I I mean, I need it. I need help. <laughs> why, why do you ask, Sister K? The Duchess gave you land? Isn't there land all over the place? Oh my goodness. The anarchist hermit crab is, is incredible, actually. Ah, the simple insights of country folk. This really is the life. You deserve something for saving my carapace, country boy. Surely this could be of use. Surely. Surely this could be of use. Good luck with your country travels. Blood starling? Okay, cool. They say I get more vitality if I get five of these. So maybe that's the way to go. I have 250 microplastics. Hey. Fish boy. <laughs> For me? Sure, surely. Only surely though. The music is so vibey for me, like, doing a bunch of aquatic murders. Yo, a little brava. Nice catch, purple blur. <laughs> I am useful. <laughs> very, very Mike Wazowski vibes. I'm on a magazine. Wait, why? I didn't stagger him at all? Huh? Do I stagger you? 
I do. Why did this guy not get staggered? Is he just tankier? I didn't realize there were different kinds of crabs. Which is uh, retrospectively a pretty silly thing for me to say. Oh, there's another crystal over there, I think. Jack Swagger, an astronaut from the Apollo 13 mission, forgot to do his taxes before launch. NASA had to follow an extension for him while he was on the moon. <laughs> hey, IRS, you think you could cut me a little bit of slack? <laughs> Am nap trapped. Good luck. We're all we're all rooting for you. There's more guys over there. Do you think they'll give me more stuff? Oi! Crab! Oh! You brought a friend. That's so that's cheating. We've talked about this. Oh! They don't stagger! Now I need a heal. But at least. Oh, I was gonna say at least they stay up there, but apparently not. Ooh, I almost took the hit on that one, but I didn't. There we go. Goodness. This is like, I'm, I'm telling you, it is surprisingly tricky. Like you don't, I think part of it is like the bright, bright graphics and everything. Like you think like, ah, oh, this should be pretty whimsical, but it's actually pretty challenging. I am surprised. I am surprised and delighted. Hi there, sweetie. Any sweeties in the trap? <laughs> that, that's not how friendship works, Garuda Waifu. Just because you can't watch my stream doesn't mean you're a bad friend. Otherwise, I'd have a lot of bad friends. Hi there, sweetie. Oh, hello. I, that sounded like I was calling people out. I wasn't. People work jobs, it turns out. <laughs> Thanks, Bellarm. I appreciate you. I have a bunch of errands to run that I've been avoiding, and one ends at your house. I was going to get coffee as a reward for myself, but probably... Oh, I got you. I got you. Oh, uh, hello, ma'am. How does the duchy find you this day? Pretty bad. My shell got stolen. And now I gotta talk to someone called the Duchess about something called Taxess. Oh dear, I don't envy you, sweetie. The Duchess isn't known for her willingness to negotiate, but I have faith in you, sweetie. I know you'll keep your head attached. I don't like how she said that. Keep my head attached. Hello, Wanderer. I haven't seen you in town before. On your way to offer tribute to our lovely Duchess, I suppose. Uh, I guess, maybe. Well, take it from me. The more you can suck up to the Duchess, the better your life in Slack Tide will be. As I always say, a happy tab a happy habitat needs a happy autocrat. A happy habitat needs a happy autocrat. You heard it here first. Keep keep your autocrats happy. Tip your waitresses. Whee! Goodbye. I'm getting a lot of barbed hooks here. Oh you, stubby. Got him. I see there's a bottle up here, and it makes me curious. Now, what? That's not who I wanted to focus. Okay, so the ones with the rings on their heads, they get staggered. Other, other kinds seem to not to. That is healing stuff. We love that. What? <laughs> Focus the dude way downtown. Good thing I just got a heal, I guess. Cha, cha. Goodbye. All right, I've got 505 microplastics. I think I can level up at least once. If I fight a few guys, I can probably level up twice. Yo, catch the cat, how's it going? How are you feeling today? And are you feeling crabby? Asking for a friend. It's me. I'm asking for myself, actually. It's apparently National Strawberries and Cream Day. Oh. Well, let's all go get some then. Honestly, a little... I mean, I've got so much of a sweet tooth. A little dessert pretty much always sounds good. 
sleepy. A lot of people have been saying they're sleepy today. I don't know, don't know what it is. Break the bottles, break, break the bottles. <laughs> is that your ASMR for today? Goop eating kelp? Oh no, there he is. <gasps> There's my souls. I mean my, my plastics. What if, oh, they said if you beat one of those guys, you get an umami point. Can I just grab my stuff, my recover my junk and dip out? I'd love to just recover my junk. Oi, stubby. Later. This game is very cute. Can I beat him? Uh, like maybe. I think I broke his shell. Hold on. Okay, there's got to, there's, those have to be like a platforming swing point. That is gotta be it. It's gotta be. I'm gonna, I'll go spend my points to level up and then I'll go fight that scary crab. For you, for content, because I love you all so much. Where's my level up point? Over here. <laughs> We had seaweed salad with dinner last night. Junk recovered, taxes evaded. I have to apologize to T after this. Oh, I literally need 23 more points and I can level up again. Okay. We'll do one here. We'll confirm. And then we'll go fight some things one more time. I just need a few microplastics. Just barely saw that guy coming for me. I'm curious to know what the different kinds of weapons in this game will be. Did I need 470? I'm gonna fight one more dude just to be safe. Just to be a safe quab. You know, the more I play this game, the more I think maybe I should evade my taxes. IRS, if you're listening, that was a joke. I promise. You there. Lovely. Okay, I think I should be good now. Maybe you'll get a companion so you can perform a pincer attack. Pincer? I have been tempted to play Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion. Oh, it's only 4.30, I did great. I did great. Um, we can get one more health or we can get one more attack damage. I don't have, I don't think I have a, I don't think I have Umami attacks. I almost said Amumu attacks, but that's a different thing. You'd like a pin? You're a mod. You should be able to pin things. Or are you saying you'd like to purchase a pin from me? Because I don't have any. Um. Let's go with more attack damage. I could get better defense, but better defense doesn't do damage. So let's try again. I'll, I'll go fight that big boy. See what he's up to. He was over here, I believe. You did ask about pins a good while ago, Nomad. And I did look into it, for the record. I did not ignore you. Um, hey. Um, the company that my merch is through does not do pins right now. They do, oh, they do, that's what it was. They do enamel pins, but you have to order them, uh, in quantities of 500. So I thought, you know, maybe I shouldn't. I'm going to just try to be very safe about this. I didn't die though. Hmm. 
Okay. The charge stab seems like a good... <laughs> no! Oh, I was so scared. That move. That's the one. You're the one. You're the one who's making me crazy. I'm in love, but it's only temporary. Whoa! Not today, Crabman Jones. I got him! Oh, wait, we already have some of these. Okay, so I still don't know what those do. But we beat that big crab guy. Now I'm going to go back and heal. <laughs> if you dodge, are you parting ways? I don't get it. <laughs> I don't use... what Usually I use um, Google Maps. I've heard good things about ways, but I don't really understand the hype. What? If you fought him a second time, would it be a comb over? Com com I don't get it. Can you explain the joke to me? I hear that's better. Sit. Oh. I wasn't expecting to be able to sit. Can I make this? Nope. Can I talk to you from down here? I don't think so. Maybe that's going to be my girlfriend later. What a cute sit. Thank you. Thank you. I've been complimented on my sitting skills for years. <laughs> okay, so, yep. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Non-game question. Does anyone know if, if we are in that peak times thing with the energy company yet? Oh, um, I don't know. I haven't heard anything about it, but that certainly doesn't mean anything. Oh, that dude gave me a bunch of, uh, of microplastics, though. Two levels worth. We'll take it. More health, more damage. Rock and roll. A popular hairstyle for men who are losing their hair on the crown of their heads is pulling longer strands of hair from the outer crown over the top of the balding pate. I'm going to go with pate. This is known as a comb over. However, over can also mean again or repeated. <laughs> so since the crab had a comb, you may have had to battle him a second. I, I'll be honest. I genuinely didn't understand that joke because I wasn't thinking about the comb. I was only thinking about dying. I was only thinking about death. Classic. See you later, guards. Classic goop, so obsessed with death and dying. Part, oh, I see, I see, that's also why I didn't. I didn't get that joke either because I wasn't thinking about combs. Oi, Bob. Got him. You there. What? You there. I'm something of a stabby crabby. I don't know if y'all knew that about me. Bye. I need to learn some umami attacks. I think I think that'll be a game changer for me. I'm very hungry. How is it only 10.30? Yo, a swarm of goopy get Oh, they're all max cuteness genettas! Exclamation catch to catch one of those 5.99 cuteness genettas! <laughs> what an exorcism sound. If the crab had an attack that pulled you into his attack range, it would probably also be a comb over here. I got you. I'll be honest, I thought you were making a combo joke. There are still three left. Nice catches, Cably, and catch the cat. 
So when I said earlier that this looks like a crab that might attack me, I think it's just a dead crab. It looks like it's wearing pants too, which is terrifying. Boom, 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 boom. There's one left. Sister K, nice catch. Bellarm, nice catch. One more. <laughs> Everybody's got to wait for their timers to come up. <laughs> Who will prevail? Y'all do that. There is not a trade Goopymon feature because nobody has been able to explain it to me in a way that won't cause bullying. <laughs> <laughs> Shirley, nice catch on that, Janetta. It's time to fight the law. Alright, let's see if we can do it now. Oh, crab. Days! Sorry. Days! To... Alright, I don't remember how to do combat. You want to do that again? You really took my advice there. This guy moves pretty slow, but I do so little damage. Oh, oh, okay. I do so little damage and he does so much. Through my blade is justice sucked. What a freaking line. You don't get that in Dark Souls. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. <sighs> Cops, man. You dare raise your blade against the law. What if I stab him? You think stabbing works? It does. I'll boil you alive, Barney. He'll boil me alive. Oh, come on. Oh. It's actually like I, I want to play so close to him that like it's almost impossible for me to dodge that attack and that is wild. Yeah. Don't want <laughs> I don't want to get caught by that attack again. Oh wait, why did it deflect me back towards him? I'm up against that wall. And I don't want that. Ow! Gotta drink some juice. Yeah. Dude's trying to end my whole career here. Yes, there we go. All right. Have ruined the law forever, Says you, pollution scoured. That that was self-defense, right? Let's go. First try, easy peasy. <laughs> Do you think he's uh he's voiced by John Goodman? Let's see, a person trade my Goopy for your Goopy as a string request and then the other person. Well, I, d I know how it would work, but but people will bully each other for specific Goopymons. They'll say, that one has my name, you have to give it to me. And then people will feel bad if they say no. I know how the internet works. I know how it works. That's gotta be self-defense. Anyone would agree. He came at me like a crazy guy. What was I supposed to do? Shuck, shuck, shuck. Okay, play it cool. If anyone asks, he just tripped and broke his leg and landed on a sword. Does everybody have their alibis prepared? I, I don't, Nomad. If, 
if people had given me reason to trust them in these instances, I would I would have faith. But unfortunately, I have had faith in the past and it has been proven wrong. <laughs> shuck, shuck, shuck. Auk, how's it going? Remember to practice your story forwards and backwards? Oh, oh, my alibi. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Welcome in, Steinatron. How's it going? We got. I got to get all of my friends in line with the story. We got to know. Uh, we we got to make sure we're using the same verbiage here. Well, wait. No, we don't want to use the same verbiage. We want to describe the same events in different ways so they don't think that we practiced it. This is gonna take a while. Okay, everybody. So repeat after me. He fell on a sword. He tripped. He broke his. Leg. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. It's not about pushing them and giving me a, but that's that's you, Shirley. And while I might trust individuals in the chat, I definitely do not trust the crowd. <laughs> yeah, I do need to. Uh, I like that the the shell blinks when it's injured. I think my shell will probably heal, leveling up here, but maybe not. We'll go, we'll, we'll keep splitting points here. Wait, no, I only have enough for one. Oh, I'm so close to a second though. We'll go more attack, I have more, more damage goodly. More damage goodly. The blinky death thing, you know. <laughs> Sinatron, I'm having a great day. This game is freaking adorable. <laughs> it's tough too, I'm so, I'm so shocked at how tough it actually is. Popular shell due to its sturdiness and simplicity. Indecipherable markings line the outside. Oh, so it didn't. It didn't heal my shell. Can I go get more? No, they all disappeared. So I just have to live with blinky shell? Oh, there are different flavors. Sweet nothing, ginseng kale. Sorry, ginseng kale. Void cherry, wasabi habanero, and unicorn sweat? I'm just like SOL on on shells. It does it does feel like I feel like Tux is probably going to play it at some point. He loves a, a good souls like. He was playing some Elden Ring last night. It was very it was very good. He was playing with an anchor as a weapon. Oh, hold up. <laughs> Did you hear about the crab that went to the gym? Chat, did you hear about the crab that went to the gym? He pulled a muscle. <laughs> Just so you don't pull a muscle, thanks. <laughs> Great timing. Great timing, no notes. All right, all right, let's, let's do a little stretch. We'll rock through this one. Look at this, he's playing hacky sack with the uh, with the kelp weed heart, heart weed kelp, heart weed kelp. That's what it is. He's playing hacky sack with some weed. He's got a lot of limbs for it. It's great. Wait. Oh. Would I have lost that if I hadn't picked that up? But yeah, we did have a friend who is like, ah, you probably don't stretch regularly. Actually, that's the one thing that we do. <laughs> oh, item. Captain, the long claw of the law. You can change costumes in the status menu. Oh, fashion. What? Oh, 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 it's like you get punched when you put on the new thing. The long claw of the law. The long law of the claw. Okay, I think I just go back now. The, why are, there's just a pile of dead starfish back here? Allegedly dead? Assumedly dead? I go down there? I don't think so. It kind of looks like I die if I go down there. Oh, there's there's an invisible wall. Good news. Good news. I don't have to find out. If you lose it, it's for real, Arnar. Oh, there's a an LP tank over there. That it looks like I can get into, but the invisible wall won't let me. So I guess we'll just go home with my flashing soda can butt. And by home, I mean back to those guards who will definitely let me through with no trouble. 
Where would you put the dead starfish? That's fair. That's fair. I hadn't considered the logistics. <laughs> Oi, grab boy. Oh, there's another shell, can shell over there. Perfect. Swap into this bad boy. Nap into this Slim Jim. Oh, see, now they're everywhere. Back in my day, you couldn't find a shell wherever you went. Now they're just littering the entire ocean. Yee. I am so hungry. What's going on? The booty swing is making me laugh so hard. <laughs> oh, this, this is far too cute for me. I should not be allowed to play this. All right, let's talk to some guards. I did, the drawbridge is definitely just a big comb. You return, exhibitionist. <laughs> okay, all right. Let's not shame people here, try hard guard. And draped appropriately, no less. I trust you spoke with the captain? The captain? Funny, I uh, must have missed him. Missed him, huh? That's pretty weird. Whatever, you're not nude anymore, and that's what counts. Hark, a weary vagabond doth grace our gates. Pray, I would see them part for open the gate, Nate. <laughs> open the gate, Nate. Nate guards the gate. Oh, no, Nate's up there, I see. You got it. Hey, I feel like there's an awful lot of violence around here. I thought the whole point of the Duchess was to make things safe. Go tell her about it, kid. See how quickly you get kicked back to your tide pool. <laughs> I, for one, vote for all the distractions. Not being nude is what counts. You heard, oh, this, this banana peel is a shell. Ah, ha, 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 he, 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 It's lighter. Do I, so do I roll faster in a lighter shell? Do I move faster? It seems about the same. I'm gonna go with it though. I like it. Hi. I'll let you pass, but don't distract our soldiers too much. We gotta train hard to keep the enemy at bay. Hey, nice snipe on that, Cably. There are some cute Goopymons in chat today. Wiki wiki. Or at Gulf, or Cove, or Strait, wherever they come from. All right, see you later, Lobster Guard. I'm gonna go, well wait, we said we were pro-distraction, so let's get distracted. Aw, look, they're all so cute. Oh, Nomad spawning a Goopymon. Goopymon. It's an NX rhyme with a cuteness value of 32, exclamation, catch catch that bad boy. What's up, guard? What are you, private? Ma'am, a clump of sand, ma'am. And what is a clump of sand good for, Private? Ma'am, to form the walls of slack tide, ma'am. And what is slack tide to you, Private? Ma'am, the prettiest place in the ocean, ma'am. You're goddamn right, Private. <laughs> They're doing jumping jacks. They've got Q-tip weapons. I can't. Hey, you seen Kelvin recently? Oh, he shipped out, part of the expedition to the moon caves. Weren't they supposed to be back by now? They must be struggling to find something for the Duchess. Poor folks, remember the last time an expedition returned empty-handed? Oh, God, don't remind me. Poor troop became shells of their former selves. Shells! Get it? Cause, cra cause crabs? It isn't easy to make it into the slack-tied royal guard. Every crab you see has worked their carapace off to get where they've got. Their carap- their whole carapace. What a- I don't know what you think you'll find up here, but you ain't gonna get the chance, small fry. Please? Okay. Empty handed, yeah, empty clawed. And I thought this was game of the year. This was the lore of Mr. Krabs. It me. This trash revolution is wonderful, isn't it? it seems like it was only yesterday we were picking heart kelp out of the weeds with our bare claws. See, now they say claws. Also, Ben Cold, welcome in. How's it going? Truly, the advance of technology has been a boon for our society with literally zero downsides. 
Wow, what a coincidence that all three of us share the exact same opinion on this. Indubitably, our aligning political beliefs are what make us the very best of friends. <laughs> That's how it works. You can only be friends with people who have the same political beliefs as you. And it's all trash capitalism all the way, baby. Trashalism, if you, if, if, if you, if you will. I forgot how words worked for a whole second there. Farming in Elden Ring. What a coincidence. I'm also playing Elden Ring right now, live on stream. Fort Slacktide. Welcome in, everybody. The captain takes his job very seriously and expects the same for all of us. We've been doing drills nonstop since high tide. Ah, the captain. Someday I'll meet him. Probably, maybe. Maybe, probably. Oh, I can break the sand barrels. That's good to know. Okay. Honestly, there's nothing important back here, but we still can't have a crab scuttle around where they please. Still can't have crabs scuttle around where they please. If you're looking for something shiny, you'd probably have better luck in the caves west of here. If you can get up there, that is. I can't, I can't go back there? Okay, all right, fair enough. It's giving dictatorship propaganda. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder if it's some sort of commentary. The people yearn for trash. The sculptures around here can be hit or miss, but I kind of dig this one. <laughs> I have killed the captain, yes. Mine is a little modded. It has more of a Bloodborne graphics setting than yours. Oh, yeah, I modded mine into crab mode. <laughs> Get it? Dig? It's, it's a shovel. Jokes are very funny. Jokes? Jokes good. I don't know what you want up this tower, but no chance, Hatchling. Don't you have more pressing manners to get to inside? That's fair. That's fair. You're really digging all the puns here? <laughs> oh, there's a whole line of people. Oh, I mean, a whole line of crabs. What are you in line for? Paying my taxes, same as everyone else. But to be honest, getting to see the Duchess's beauty in person is almost worth the trip in itself. Now remember what we talked about, Vito. Don't speak when the Duchess is speaking, or she'll chop me head off. That's a good boy. What are you here for? Begging the Duchess not to demolish my house for a new food court. You know how it is. Classic. This feels very uh, Emperor's New Groove. The Duchess is giving Cusco vibes. Glad I have at least a snack while I wait for my audience with the Duchess. This snack looks a little ashy. Oh, it is just a cigarette butt. It's a bit of an acquired taste, but it's the latest thing in the big city. Crabs smoking cigarettes. News at 11. What did you bring to pay your taxes with? I found this shiny little thingamajig digging through the sand all over by the drop off. That thing? She's probably gonna. She's probably got a hundred of those already. You're gonna get thrown out of the throne room. Oh, Bird is nervous. Are you okay? You look like you're gonna steam inside your shell. I'm just stressed, okay? It's a big deal to meet with the Duchess. That's fair. Hurry along, civilian. It's not every day our Duchess takes visitors. What are you looking at? Uh, not you. Hey! Where do you think you're going, chum? I'm gonna go see the Duchess lady? Oh yeah, just gonna walk in and see the Duchess, huh? What do you think we're all standing about for? A tour? Come back when you've made an appointment like the rest of Actually, due to a gap in our schedule, our Royal Duchess is receiving walk-ins for the next 15 minutes. Wait, huh? Oh, neat. I'll head on in then. Oh, I'm a tax evading line skipper. I am the worst. What's in this room? No, no way. I was supposed to clean up back here, but I haven't had a chance yet. I don't want you to see it. Just give me like a few minutes, okay? I promise I'll get it done. It's cause for celebration. Incredible. Hello. Word of advice, civilian. Your presence here is a privilege. Don't scuttle around where you aren't asked. Well, that's what I'm doing currently. Oh. I'm excited to find out what the fish hooks do and how I can use them.
I don't know if I'm supposed to go up here. Ah ha ha ha! An item. A limpet. This tiny snail adheres to rock so strongly that removing it by force will often kill it. Plus two resistance. Oh, it's a stowaway! I got it! Of her hindsness. Bellarm, this this game might ruin you. That's how I am when someone says they want to stop by my house. Don't look in there! Just give me a few minutes. <laughs> You just found your first stowaway, a little friend that you can equip in the status menu to gain all sorts of benefits. But their bonuses only apply while you're wearing a shell, so don't take them for granted. Acknowledge the knowledge. Stowaway. Limp it. Hardly know it. No adaptations yet. Okay, I think we found what we need to find here. Woo! These urchins, man, I tell ya. I'm about to like go get a snack in a second. My tummy is angry with me. They're just little friends. It's not a pet, it's a partner, okay? We're in this together. We're all in this together when we know we're a I don't know what you think you'll find up here, but you ain't gonna get the chance, small fry. Everything is closed off. When we know who we are, we're all stars, and we see that. My pet and I are also friends in this together. Well, okay. I just didn't want to demoralize the limpet, right? Like, I didn't want to reduce it to just being a pet. Maybe it, it, it's very intelligent and would feel upset by that. I love that they have badges that just say gatekeep on them. Is there anything fun back here? No. <laughs> I don't know anything about this limpet. I don't want to make uh, assumptions right out the gate, you know? Oh, hello. Oh, she's got a tea infuser. Speak. Duchess Magista. Oh, uh, yes, ma'am. I uh, recently had my shell taken away, and I was wondering if there's any way we could work out some sort of a. Do you like my castle, little hermit? Welcome back, Project. Your castle? Oh, um, it's pretty neat, I guess. You guess? A lot of work went into this place, you know. Looks like it. Work made possible by generous contributions from citizens like yourself. So generous. So generous. And it was worth it. Don't you think? I wasn't expecting this game to be a commentary on so many different things. Oh, yeah, uh, definitely. Look, I can find another way to pay my taxes, but for now, I'd really just like to... Even more gorgeous than the coral. Oh my goodness, she's so full of herself. <laughs> I've never been to. I mean, yeah, absolutely. The reefs are super overrated. Uh, everyone says so. Oh, perhaps we can work out a deal, little hermit. But first, I'll need something from you. Right. I didn't expect the 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 capitalism angle on this. My castle still lacks a certain panache, pizzazz, flair. Pizzas. Je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. A platoon went out on my behalf to recover something shiny and. Gorgeous from the cave to the west. Oh, I'm getting conscripted. But those buffoons haven't reported in since. Such incompetence. This is how people Climb refer to me. The Western Tower to begin your journey to the cave. Then catch up with my platoon and help recover something worthy of my beauty. <laughs> Return to me with Trinket in Claw, and we can speak of delaying your tax payments for no longer than two calendar tides. Okay. Okay, thank you. I won't let you down. I'll get you the shiniest thing I can. She does have, there are chess pieces in the back. It oh, does yeah. feel very uh, Alice in Wonderland. The crazy murderous crabs outside trying to... 
Be gone, little hermit. I tire of you. Ouch. Yes, ma'am. See you later. What a what a a lovely, generous lady that was. I'm a big fan of hers, obviously. He said go through the west tower. Oh, hey there. Hey, can I get by here? Does it look like it? A shipment of the fort's defensive urchins got spilled across the hall. It's really got the Duchess up in arms. Arms? She's already executed five people over it. Whoa. Well, I really got to get by here. Duchess's orders. Duchess's orders, huh? All right, tell you what. I think there's some leftover gear in the room across the hall that could help you get into this tower. Just don't go blaming me if you get yourself hurt. Uh, okay, thank you. Now we got to go into that guy's messy room. Just realized you have voiced some of the narration and... Oh, oh, oh yes, correct, yeah. There are some parts that have voice lines and some parts that do not. And there are also cutscenes. I'm required to be a big fan. Yeah, exactly. There's a lot of pressure on me to be a big fan. All right, I guess I can let you in if you're on a Duchess approved mission. I really didn't want you to see the mess back here. Just find what you need and skedaddle, okay? And please don't tell anyone. I'll have it cleaned up soon, promise. Ah, uh, water. Mario, selected raw tobaccos. It says, ooh, my lungs on it. <laughs> <laughs> Open me. Ah, you won't. Warning, these cigarettes will carcinize you. Our first carcinization joke. What a what a time to be alive. Uncrustworthies. Shuckers, uncrustworthies. Cheddar cheese and mayo sandwich on white bread. Exceptional. Grape jelly mozzarella sandwich. They've done far too good a job here. Uncrustworthies. This room was supposed to be cleaned up like two tides ago. First the urchin spill blocking the west tower, now this. A wild goop, another one. A prima, squa a prima quack squeak with a cuteness value of zero. Oh, it's the ugliest mon. It's the ugliest mon. No way I'll be able to meet up with my platoon in time. I really wanted to impress the Duchess. Sorry, buddy. That's rough, buddy. Talk to me when your girlfriend turns into the moon. Hey, I feel like the water bottles are going to end up being something, too. They seem really particularly placed. I think this is where we're supposed to go. Learn to fish. Fishing line. A sturdy piece of string. Hold left trigger to aim... At a fish hook, then release to grapple towards it. Okay, left trigger. Sturdy piece of string used to swing from place to place or to entangle one's foes. Okay, cool. This definitely has Star Wars vibes. Hachicha. Woo! Now we're cooking with cooking juice. Hiya! Lovely. Oh, we got a sea star. The legend says these can grant any wish. They're wrong, though. I love it when the legends are wrong. Anything higher than this? I think I think that's it. Ah, <laughs> oh, nice catch, Ben Cold. Friends, we have grappling hooks. Indeed, we do. Mario cigarettes. Yes, they say, <laughs> ooh, open me. You won't. Are you going to say the same thing? Yeah. Yoink. Woo. Okay, this is immediately very fun. Woo. Okay, wait. Why is the platforming in this game good, too? Rusty nail, a sharp corroded blade, more fit for an insect than a crab. Plus four attack, but minus three MSG. 
And you need plus three resistance required. Okay, so I can't wield it because I don't have plus three resistance. Incredible. I have no notes on this game. I'm about to fall to my death. Still no notes, though. It's almost like it's a well-made game. It's true. I haven't actually, wait. Fishing line when you're asking your date a leading question. So for our date, do you want to be picked up at six or seven? <laughs> I mean, honestly, if it works, it works, right? Oh. Ow. Wait. Ow. Ooh. Ow. Nailed it. Hook, line, and sinker. Sinker? My shell is badly damaged. I can't get out. I'm stuck. I take back every good thing I've ever said about anything. <laughs> Wait, is what is what a receipt? Oh, I'm all the way back here. Can I teleport? Can I shell port? The game said something earlier about shelleportation. But I don't know how it works. I guess I gotta fight my way back to the castle. Yeah. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I haven't seen anything about, uh, about this game before I played it. <laughs> like, I watched the trailer and that was it. I'm going in completely blind, and honestly, I feel like it was a good choice. I'm having such a good time. Get got, fish boy. Oh, I've made enemies. Okay, that guy's fine. Teleportation is when you transport your shells from one place to another in an instant. Well, I think I can travel like from bonfire to bonfire, and they call it shelleportation. <laughs> Thanks! I'm having a great time watching you have a great time watching me having a great time. Did I say all that correctly? We may never know. All right, let's find my stinking microplastics. I see you, Boots. Sneezy boy. I almost walked right into that urchin. Okay, so they were back here, right? There we go. Hopefully it lets me get them without... Without uh, getting stuck again. Okay, let's try that again. Yoink. The like little cutscene of it is lovely. Do I need to use this hook to get... No. Woo! What you gonna do with all that junk? Well, I was planning on putting it in my trunk. Alarm, does that work for you? Now don't ask about what's in my jeans. Ow. Okay, I successfully avoided it this time, but does it keep coming? No, it looks like it was a one-time dealy do, and I'm cool with that. If you can. <laughs> oh, Shell, are you okay? I can't believe I dropped it. I'm so stupid. I had one job, and it was to hold that urchin in place until the captain comes back. Now that I think about it, he might have been joking around. Classic Captain Nefro, a golden smile and the joyful heart of a prankster. Anyway, sorry I almost killed you there. A joyful smile, a golden heart of a trickster. That's my experience with him. Uh... <laughs> oh, is he about to give me a... Yeah, shortcut. Love it. A staple of the Souls-like. Oh, I can just wear a bottle shell. Or a, bo a bottle cap as a shell. It's so cute. It's so small. 
Hey, I'm impressed. I didn't think anyone could make it up here with all those urchins spilled everywhere. Thanks. Still getting new to grappling around, or still new to grappling around, but I'm getting the hang of it. Could you do me a favor then? Some mates of mine went to survey the moon cave some time ago, and no one's seen them since. If you're heading up this way, if you're heading up this way to the caves, could you keep an eye out for them? Sure. Anything for you, Beyonce. I got a barnacle. An immobile arthropod with a tough shell often found attached to larger structures. It is also a stowaway. So I can add another. Oh, I have several stowaways. R. But I only have three slots. I see. I see. I get it. I understand. So that gives me vitality. This guy gives me resistance. This guy just gives me plus 10 defense. That's wild. I assume I can't equip a third. No. No, 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 no. A bot, no, no cap, Bellarum. He was so happy when he was shouting at me about the law. So happy. Woo! I'm gonna go this way just for, uh, thoroughness. What's the word I'm looking for? Just to be thorough? That sludgy stuff looks bad. Woo! Goodbye. I don't... I'm going to avoid stepping in the ooze. Sorry, ooze fans. This game is about netting plastic or plastic netting. Bo both, I think? I think both. I learned recently that a thing can be two things. Ooh, a tin can. Medium weight adds a... Oh, 40 defense and adds resistance. Okay. I'm getting all the shells today. Oh, I just 100% pressed the wrong button. That's on me. Yo, homie. What if... We didn't come at me... Like a spider monkey. I have more health now. Right? Interesting. Woo! And a save point. We love that. All my homies love save points. In an effort to recover his home, the plucky hermit crab ventures into a mysterious cave. <laughs> Not my circus, but I do recognize the spider monkeys. I got you. I got you. With the obviously poisonous ooze, you think that might be bad? Like, maybe. I still walked into the urchins earlier, <laughs> knowing that they would probably hurt me. <laughs> it's called science. But he quickly discovered that the return journey will be significantly more challenging. H Hello? Who's talking? He approaches the ghostly figure in front of him. I'm gonna actually do this first. We'll, we'll do a little heal up and I think we get to level up once here. I have been compelled to increase my resistance for that one stowaway item. Okay, lots of shells here. Hi, uh, my name's Krill. Do you know of anything shiny in this cave? Something that might impress like a huge beautiful crab lady? <laughs> Is anyone in the chat trying to impress a huge beautiful crab lady? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> All are welcome and you specifically. We perform a lot of tax evasion. Ooh. <laughs> Confused and desperate, the hermit crab begins begging help from strangers. Hey, I'm not desperate yet. Thus far, he has persevered by taking refuge in artifacts from beyond the waves. But to survive from here on out, he must awaken the currents inside of him. He must access the power of umami. Umami? Look, if there's some secret I should know about, can you please just tell me what it is? Stuff's been convoluted enough ever since I left the tide pool. Feeling pity for the helpless creature, the noble moon snail deigns to awaken his latent abilities manually. I want to, I want to give a word of caution. I want to give a word of caution to all of you. If someone on the street offers to, and I quote, awaken your latent abilities manually... 
Run. Run. Say no thank you and run. <laughs> Time to choose my allegiance. <laughs> I can't try to please the crab lady when I go to Furch. Ah, you're trying to appease the frog lady. <laughs> I gotcha. <laughs> it is, it's for sure against TOS. You better not be messing with, whoa! What the shell was that? I feel tingly. <laughs> The hermit crab dons a metal shell and feels a new ability awaken. I do? Yes, he does. Umami training, shell spells, spells if you will. Would you prefer to have your latent abilities awoken automatically? No comment. <laughs> That's known as puberty. <laughs> this is truly Emperor's new groove. Look at the character talking to the narrative, right? Yeah. <laughs> Gives a tingly feel. Ah, God darn it. While wearing a shell, press X to consume umami charges and activate its unique shell spell, X. Used umami charges will regenerate slowly when you attack enemies with your fork. Okay, so like force powers. <laughs> shell shock. I'm an electric crab! So what is this umami stuff exactly? The hermit crab continues into the cavern, excited to make use of its new ability. A creature blocks the hermit crab's path. Immune to his physical attacks, it may only be dispatched by his newfound umami powers. Well, isn't that convenient? The noble moon snail denies any involvement in manufacturing this scenario. <laughs> Hit me. I don't have any, oh wait, it said it recharges through hitting things. That's right. Did it just dodge me? Oh, there we go. The once innocent hermit crab's ability to slaughter his enemies has increased dramatically. Did you have to put it that way? He senses the, the renewed reward he seeks lies further within this cavern, as well as the opportunity to meet his newfound idol, the mysterious and attractive moon snail in the flesh. Guess I've got no choice. I've always, I've been looking for years for a mysterious and attractive moon snail. What is this about? Hello? What? what did, oh, did it? Oh, it charges up my umami. Classic. Is that the Phantom Menace? You right. If someone spoke to me like I I was in the third person, I don't know what I'd do. <laughs> ah, what? Okay, not a death, just a respawn. We take those. Okay, so do different shells have different spells? Are there different strokes for different folks is also what I'm asking. Pop off. Oh. So the crystals did refresh my umami. That's neato. I think I'm gonna stick with the bottle cap for now. <laughs> oh, you can do DC down, Bellarum. That, that one I thought through. There you go. <laughs> I haven't thought through every command in this channel, but that one I have. We got more bread claw. So this one's just like a strong attack, I guess. Goodbye. That's the sound of climbing, if you weren't aware. Okay. Whatever floats your crab boat, you know? I do know. Oh. I gotta beat that guy for more umami crystals. Sir. He's got a Q-tip. Oh, can I just triple hit him with this? I can! Would you look at that? That's all you can do. 
Nice. Okay. And a shortcut. We love that. I. It's such a silly thing, but I think that Souls-like games do level design so incredibly well with the like fighting through a tough place and then giving you a shortcut. I. It's it's great design. It's brilliant. I love it so much. I didn't know. I didn't think that would move. Do you think I can knock the bottle cap off of it? Get it as a shell? <laughs> oh, wait, I want that, but I don't want to jump off the ledge for it. Uh... Oh, he had a two attack. Was not expecting that. Okay. I like that that ability recharges pretty quickly, right? The the guy who said that my ability to murder things has greatly improved uh, was not wrong. He was pretty right on that one. We got another limpet. I love the jellyfish platforms. I It's wild to me that the platforming of this game is like... Very similar to, to Star Wars. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, no. Probably because probably I needed a snack. Probably because I needed a snack. I think at this point I just make it through until lunchtime. Oh, okay. I lost my, uh, lost my shell. See you later, Mr. Moon Snail. Seems like the game is a perfect combo of games you're playing lately. Yeah, it's like weirdly weird. It's it's a strange intersection. Like it, it's that is strangely accurate. Weirdly similar to everything I've been doing lately. Oh, that was fun. Oh! I'm falling off the edge, but we're going to get a tool tip real quick. <laughs> it, it does seem very goop coated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hitting an enemy with enough attacks to max out their balance meter will open them up to being capsized. When their health bar starts flashing, hit them with a powerful attack such as a charge attack and knock them down for several seconds. Ah. Well... <laughs> Cap size matters. Well, it's not the size, it's... Why did I not use my attack there? I, I did capsize him at the very end there. <laughs> I, it, it is, it's almost like, I don't know how to put it. It's wild how, tricky the combat is for how it looks. Like it does not leave you a ton of room to not get hit by things. Recovered, oh, it's my junk from last time. Um, I was enjoying that fizzle attack, but it did knock me back, which I didn't love. Yo, one for Mrs. E, how's it going? Welcome in, happy Tuesday. How's yours going? A shot glass? Okay. <laughs> I'm here for this. That looks like the mermaid things that Ursula makes. Wait, what does? Oh, there's an item up here that I just missed. Whoop, that's the wrong button. Oh, glad to hear it, Mrs. E. Okay. Um. Oh, there's scissors over there. Can I use the scissors as a weapon? I'm gonna go up here and explore first because of course I am. 
Oh! Hold up. Let me hit you again. I need to do that ability one more time. <laughs> let me use these as weapons. Please let me use the little cocktail swords as weapons. Please! I need it! I, I'm i so sad. My whole day is ruined. Can I use the scissors as a weapon? My whole life is ruined. I think it's pretty pretty easy to say. <laughs> Goodbye. I just go full like hedgehog mode there. I love that. Cha, cha. Goodbye. Can someone tell me why Tiny Little Sword is getting censored? Oh no. Uh, that's on your end, Shirley, if it is. You must have like some kind of uh, mod setting on. Some kind of uh, like chat censorship. Because it's not getting censored online. I think you mentioned something about things getting censored in words on stream before too. And that I don't think was happening for anybody else. Oh. Oh. Bell Arm doesn't see it. Interesting. Can I use the scissors as a weapon? <laughs> that was fair. That was fair. Yeah. I'm going to swap out my shell here. The, the defense on this is not a lot. But I do get to go full porcupine. Yeah, it's got to be like a profanity filter. These guys get staggered easy. I like that. Oh, God. Oh, it's another comb one. Ow! And we're not doing that again. All right, buddy. Oh, no! Oh, my shell broke. But wait. He's down there, and I'm up here. Oh, another blood star limb. Okay. I don't have to fight him legally sales wait the word sales wouldn't say that's so weird huh that is so weird yeah because that doesn't happen on my end it's not like a stream profanity filter. It's got to be like a you personal profanity filter on your Twitch settings. Huh. I didn't even know that was a thing. Ow. Oh. <laughs> he fell to his death. I love that. That's a party hat. Party time is the ability. Why, why is this so clever? All the different abilities are so fun. I gotta, I gotta know. Find me an enemy. Errol, how's it going? Welcome in. Comb over 2.0, a brush with death. I can't wait to see that in theaters. Your first loss. I'm so sorry, Errol. I'm so sorry. What is this? This is like a yellow pineapple. Ooh, I get to heal here. That's nice. Uh, why does it look like there's a big scary dude down there? It's a balloon weight. Oh, you're right. It totally is. It totally is. T -t -t totally do. You've been avenged. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's give it a go. It's like, I think that's the best way to put it, Nomad. It really is a heckin' delight. All right, let's get our butts whooped. I still don't know what party time is, but I'm about to. Oh, great! 
Crushing attacks. The blue aggro symbol lets you know an enemy is about to use a crushing attack. These are powerful blows that are very likely to break your shell if you're hiding in it. When you see it, be sure to dodge, run, or jump out of the way. Okay. Oh, but it follows. Good to know. What is the music though? Oh, okay. I couldn't dodge out of the way. I I was stuck inside its claw range. <coughs> oh, it just puts me right back up here. Okay, that's not too bad at all. Recover my junk. I do like how forgiving the like boss fight mechanic is. It has a bow. Right, it, it is a bop. You're correct. Okay, let's learn some. Uh, Oh wait, I need a Why do people want me <laughs> One for Mrs. E. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. I hope your Tuesday is going great. Thanks for making mine a little bit better. Get fizzled on. I'm so nervous. Oh, the bow is the top of a trash bag. I'm gonna eat some juice. Whoa! Not today. There we go. Oh, we capsized him. Let's go. Oh. Broke their bottle. Oh, but it stabs now. Oh, but it stabs. No. Oh. I was like, oh, yeah, I got him. Easy peasy. Easy money. I did not have them. It was not easy peasy. It was not easy money. I was embarrassed. All right, let's do this, ma'am. Oh, come here, so you get hit by the fizzles. So the fizzles only hit if they're close. Oh, hold up. Okay. Gotta learn some dodge timing here. Ooh, gotta learn some dodge timing here. That sucked. Don't stab me, bro. Wait, why can't I heal? Oh, no. Eat your kelp, buddy. Okay. Really just got to get away on those. Oh, I'm in a corner. Need another shell. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so they do a triple stab there. Oh, God. I never. I'm watching the bottle, and so every time that he goes to get me with the. with the other arm, I don't expect it. Oh, I'm dead. Oh. 
<laughs> These bosses are hard. Sheesh. Uh, what's tied around his claw? It looks like maybe some rope. Oh no. Don't want to get bottlenecked. Har. All right. Uh, what is this? Fourth time? Fourth time's the charm. Backing you? Afraid not. The beginning of this song does sound like uh, milkshakes. Oh my goodness. Ow. Okay. Yeah, that has like no wind up animation. It just slaps you. Out. Too late. That sucks. I baited it out that time. Ah, whoa, 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 I'm in trouble. Okay, okay. I almost had it capsized before. Oh, oh my shell broke. It wasn't me dying. Ow, whoa, okay. Okay, okay, so you can't dodge left on him because you just run into the claw? This is insidious, actually. We can do this though, I believe in us. Oh, I wasn't using my special attacks. I should have been using those. My milkshakes brings all the crabs to the reef. Dang right, this crab got beef. <laughs> You're not wrong. I think the music also, like in Dark Souls, crabs, you're fighting crabs, like these. Crabs, 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 crabs. Red Zero. Crabs, 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 crabs. Oyster shells. Oyster shells. Crabs, 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 crabs. Red Zero, thank you for the 12 crab biddies. How appropriate today. Uh, what was I going to say? I, I think part of it is in Dark Souls, when you fight an enemy, uh, they're like huge demonic like the the music is like orchestral and and swelling and it's like oh you know and it feels super intense and in this one you're like just getting slapped around while <laughs> getting hit by uh what was the what was the bottle cap attack oh it's wait no i don't remember what the bottle cap attack is pop off oh it's just like a big hit Okay, we're, we're gonna get him. You can though, cause his claw extends out in front of him. You can get some extra hits from decently far away. Ow, or you can get hit. That knocks him into the air, like, just a little bit. <laughs> we're dancing. We're dancing. Call me Ted, because I'm dancing right now. Oh, I try. Oh, I try. That one shot me from, like, full health. I thought I was doing pretty well that time. <laughs> it's like I'm in a street dance-off. That's what I've always wanted. I don't think I don't think pop off is the ability that I want. If there were a shot glass in here, I think I'd want that. But this one feels like free hits.
Good reaction, Goop. That's why they call me Good Reaction Goop. Bad Reaction Goop. That's why they call me Bad Reaction Goop. Oh, what? No, come on. I dodged that. Rude dude. Okay, but they do let you just like instantly replay the boss fight. So that's really nice. <laughs> Pop off is the ability to to vomit immediately. I think you're misreading that. <laughs> it's not immediate. It's after uh, it's after one bottle, I believe. This guy really doesn't seem to like me, and I don't understand why. There you go. He attacked into it. We love that. Good dodge, Coop. I just gotta stay calm during those. The stab attack is gonna do me in here. It really is. I'm not prepared for it. Okay. I do need to drink some juice. I'm so nervous. Back it up, goop. Okay, that should do it. Woo okay. One bubble hit him and he died. Well done. Well done, everybody. Sheesh. A gorgeous pearl manufactured somewhere beyond the ocean. Looks perfect for impressing royalty. That's what we need to do. We need to impress a big crab lady. Uh, what did he say? A large, beautiful crab lady. Good. If I could have, uh, if I could have beefed up my defenses, I would have. But they don't spawn you back to like a what, what is a bonfire in Dark Souls, which I don't think is a bad thing. Oh, that's the that's the Moon Snail guy. This is my dad, Moon Snail's domain. <laughs> he back it up, Goop. <laughs> Put it in reverse, Terry. I'm gonna talk to him first before I break these crystals. At long last, the hermit crab lays eyes on the powerful, borderline sensual body of the moon snail. Very full of yourself, Mr. Moon Snail. Hi. Uh, th thanks for leading me here. I think the Duchess is really gonna like this pearl. But I still need a way to get out of this cave. In order to progress, the hermit crab will need to further expand on his umami abilities. Cool, how do I do that? I'm getting to it. I mean, uh, the hermit crab closes his eyes and allows himself to become one with the waves. He notices the effect his body has on the currents around him and lets himself be changed by them in turn. Okay. Hey, when I close my eyes, I can start to see something. I see a tree? Some sort of tree? Of skills? Gotta fish up your defenses too, not just beef them up. Shellaporte. Oh, so I hadn't unlocked shellaportation yet. I see. Every single thing leaves currents in its wake as it travels through the ocean. Be it a living person, a beast, a corpse, or even a piece of garbage. The life force of the ocean, the beating heart of this world. This phenomenon is known as umami. <laughs> like Moana? I've never heard of Moana. No clue. Invisible to most, umami currents can be detected only by a chosen few. Even fewer still can make use of them. Oh, the glowing purple stuff. I've been seeing that. I've seen that some. I've seen that surrounding some big shells and crystals out there. Surprising. I guess I didn't need to zap you then. 
I mean, uh, the hermit crab's training may progress faster than anticipated. He feels that perhaps if he enters a discarded moon, shell sna moon snail shell, a new use for it might reveal itself. Thanks, sensuous moon snail. You are quite sensuous. The hermit crab returns, prepared to augment his abilities. Oh, he'll just teach me skills. Cool. Skewer. Press right bumper while sprinting to perform a rapid lunging attack. Parry. Oh, God. Release your block the moment an enemy strikes to perform a parry. Your shell won't take damage and your opponent might flinch. Streamline. Press B mid-jump to gracefully dodge through the air. Okay. I mean, that sounds really nice. I can get all three of these, though, right? The hermit crab moves like the water itself, performing practical acts of acrobatics to avoid his predators. <laughs> but one wrong move and it could all be over. Elusive prey become invincible for several seconds after your shell is broken. Attacking will end the effect early. Each shell's shell spell may be cast once for free without using a moment. I mean, that's really nice, huh? I'm going to get all of the base level ones just to see like what opens up to what. On the open ocean, many creatures must take advantage, must take of another's body in order to survive. The hermit crab has taken life many times already, but as his story escalates, so too must the violence. Jeez. Uh, no, I uh, I beat the uh, the boss, Bellarum. I think you're all good. We'll go with Perry. The hermit crab shell is invaluable in protecting him from predators. But protection will not be enough. To achieve his goals, he must make his shell a tool of aggression. He d he deflects his enemy's attacks, destabilizing and confusing them. How can such a small creature withstand such massive blows? It seems to defy the natural order. Okay. Way of the true crab, way of the predator, and way of the hermit. Defeating an enemy with an umami-based attack will restore an umami charge. That's nice. Ebb and flow. Press right bumper immediately after dodging an attack with skedaddle to perform a power spell. There's one called skedaddle? There is. Okay. Okay. Hold left bumper to block. Then release the button right before an enemy attacks to attack lands to parry the attack. Taking no shell damage. This will also harm your opponent's balance, getting them closer to becoming capsized. Press right bumper while sprinting to perform a rapid lunging attack. I love this. This is what I want. Press A to jump, then B to gracefully dodge through the water. I also wanted this. Skedaddle! Okay. Get a few more here, I guess. Ah! I don't think there are any more. I guess we'll just go up here. You know me, I'm skedaddling all over the place. Shellaporting. Krill's attunement to Umami will now enable him to warp between any moon snail shells he has previously visited. I'm gonna level up though. I think I just go for this. Yeah. I need 1280 to level up again. Woohoo. Okay. <laughs> Yo, Space Gecko, how's it going? <laughs> Let's shellaport to Haven Respite. Moon Snail's Cave, Moon Snail. Okay, okay, so Central Shallows would be the place to go? The Hermit Crab knows instinctively to return to this place whenever he faces danger beyond his abilities. I will, thank you. While we're at it, can you tell me how taxes work? The Hermit Crab knows instinctively to stop pushing his luck. <laughs> I think this is probably a good time for me to go uh, grab some lunch. What do you mean, Bellarm? This has been uh, crabs the whole time. Only crabs. No BRBs, only crabs. Um, I gotta say, I don't understand. There are some streamers who I've heard talk at length about how they don't eat lunch when they're streaming. They just like power through. I have no clue how people do that. I get to lunchtime and I am famished. 
crab herb. Whatever happened to Craburban Rhythm? Oh, okay. I see why I was trying to get up here earlier now. Yeah. Okay. Rock and roll. I wish those streamers would look out for themselves eating. Right, exactly. And like having good habits around that stuff. Like, I don't, I don't mean to like pretend like I, <laughs> oh, he fell to his death. Like I am or should be the authority on, on things. But like, I am in a public location. People are watching me. I am modeling things. I should model good uh, good habits, right? I don't know. I know probably everybody doesn't think that way. Oh, nice. Okay, okay, okay. So getting that, that dodge in the air move is actually going to be super clutch for me. Nice. I only need one more of these. Because um, it's going to mean I can do a lot more like interesting platforming honestly the platforming moves for this are almost identical to star wars jedi survivor and like i'm 75 maybe more percent of the way through that game and only just got that like grappling hook move that i have in this one i don't want to try a parry yeah oh he floundered <laughs> Baby's first parry. Look at that. Some people like to play words on stream, so I mute and eat while we play. I just think as long as you aren't chomping in the mic, we're talking. <laughs> right, exactly, exactly. And, like, I go back and forth on the words on stream thing. Ooh. Oh, no, nah, I'm good. I'm all full up. Um, but I don't understand how people are just like, nah, I'm not going to do food at all. Like, eat. That's good for you. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm the weirdo. Why is everything gray now? This was also vibrant before. <gasps> what happened here? The drawbridge. I've been standing watch my whole life. For what? Got nothing in return. Hey, excuse me. I gotta get back in to see the Duchess again. It keeps piling up. All the trash. All the work. Are you like okay, man? Sick of it. I'm sick to death of all of it. I'm sick to death of Blogic. It's all so worthless. Oh, buddy. This is not the way. Oh, wait. I can do a new move. Yo, watch me parry this fool. I did not. I tried. Oh, okay, that didn't work. <laughs> oh, my block didn't happen in time. Okay. I'm so sorry, weary guard. I didn't want for that to go that way, but I do appreciate the uh, umami boost. That's pretty nice of you. The reach, right? Right, exactly. And that was such a big thing when, um, when T and I talked about me going full time. It was like... None of it is worth it if it doesn't actually serve us, right? Like, if it doesn't actually improve our lives. Like, if we, if I get into streaming and I just take on every single bad habit, it's like a long clam, a muscle. If I just take on every single bad habit and, like, our lives get considerably worse, that is, that is super duper not worth. Gotta, gotta make sure that the stuff that we're doing is actually serving us. Do it. My shell is badly damaged. I'm a little bit worried about fighting big boy over here. A 
Hey, no worries, Blogic. You just got called out in the game. I've seen some Eaton play at the same time. That I'm totally okay with, yeah. Wait, can I? Hang on, can I parry him? I'm gonna die doing this, just so we're all aware. Oh, I hit the ooze. Okay, so that's what the resistance buildup stuff is for. If you stay in that for too long, you get ouchied. Love that, big fan, big fan. We really went like full anarchy. I don't know what happened here, but like, it seems society has collapsed in some, collapsed in some sort of way. My shell is badly damaged. Uh oh. There we go. Okay, using the different abilities actually pretty clutch. Oh, that was already. Uh, let's try the banana peel. The banana peel without it getting oozed. No man, nice snipe on that. A Nisking. Can I get a Goopasem Nisking in the uh, in the chat? <laughs> Lunch is a um, a slice of uh, or a couple slices of leftover meatloaf from last night. What was the shiny thing the Duchess wanted? We got a pearl. But it looks like we're not gonna be able to get that back to her. Oh, apple point up here. Can't quite get to it, looks like. I probably have to climb up and over and out. I don't know why. Oh, it might just be Goopus M. Nisk. Hey, Goopus M. Nisk. That should be a... Parry timing, always by nemesis. There we go. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm pretty sure that's like a Frank or Faze Z emote. We had a, a running joke a long time ago that... Uh, uh, Nisking was the opposite of trolling. Where like, uh, in, instead of messing with your friends or gaslighting them or something, uh, you're just like obnoxiously supporting them. <laughs> like nisking for the homies. Oh, it, or no, it was the friend version of simping. That's what it was. It was back when simping was like the hot phrase with the kids. Ooh, that's a puffer fish <gasps> with a balloon weight. Oh, my shell broke. That's not good. Ow. Ow! Or no. Yikers. Mm, gas lamping. <laughs> Did I misspeak cably? I apologize. Sometimes I, uh, sometimes I space out and uh, forget things. Oh, I probably should have grabbed a shell. There's one up here. Give me that pop bottle, baby. Honestly, I like the pop ability most of all the ones I've used so far, I think. I didn't have to refight that guy, so that's nice. Yes, yes, yes. Gas lamping. My apologize. My, my apologize for any confusion. Get 
get capsized. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Goop, what's your cap size? Uh, it's like a medium. Actually, no, that's not true. I got a big head. My cap size is definitely large. Oh, I still got hit by that. Love it. Oh, watch this. Watch this. Oh, I paired him. Ha ha ha! Get donked! You see me donk that guy? My father told me the history of kerosene and its influence to create one of the richest men on the planet. Really? You know, I don't often think of kerosene. Oh, I parried him! Nice! My shell is badly damaged, but my spirit remains unbroken. There's a YouTube docu documentary series called Rise of the Titans or something like that that goes over the richest people like Warren Buffett. Ah. And Kerosene Man is on there? I keep trying to parry and I should stop. I mean, probably I should stop. I don't know. I'm gonna keep moving forward. I'm probably gonna die. I'm gonna recover all my junk. Parried? That's my shell breaking. Hop into this one. Wait, why am I sideways? Parried. And do a little heel move. Parried. That was too much work, but I can't get the party hat. Caused a huge monopoly front. Remember that time someone threw a tissue box in my face and it hit my eye and I went to the eye doctor. They thought I had a super contagious eye infection. I got five days off work and it turned out it was just red from getting hit by the tissue box. <laughs> oh my goodness. Party butt, that's true. I do have a party butt now. Look at me. I want to be clear that I was not the one who threw the tissue box in that situation. It was our lovely brother. <laughs> but Sister K has been very clear since then that she would really like you to not throw tissue boxes to her anymore. Which I think is understandable. Oh, good. A little kelp plant back here. Can I get other weapons in this game or is it just always the always the fork? Oh, that guy's angry at me. Okay. 
that guy's down there. I had a little snack. I had some dranky drank. It's time. I buried him. Call me a platypus. I can do that too. Look at that. Haha. -ha. My stab is stabbier though. Wait, what are you answering? I was just listening to the album I bought during that five day quarantine. Oh, <laughs> I'm a platypus. Oh, if I get more weapons or if it's just the fork? Uh, I'm sure I'll figure it out. Crime, coveting his neighbor's shell. Oh. Oh, that guy coveted his neighbor's shell, got in trouble. Oh, that's a big spooky guy. Let's do it. Ow, what? He interrupted my party time. A criminal. I forgot what button was what. Oh, I am so trapped. Help? I, what? Oh, whoa, whoa, I'm still alive. Hold on. Hold on loosely. Crabs, 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 I parried him accidentally. Welcome back, Ash. Thank you so much for the uh, 12 crab biddies. I appreciate that so much. I hope you're having a good day. Let's go, Crab Man Jones. It's time. We knew the party wouldn't last long, let's be honest. Yeah, yeah. Got him. We've broken our party, but it was bound to happen. It was bound to happen. We knew it would happen. We. Okay. I don't really know where I'm supposed to be going right now, but I am having a good time spider manning all over it. Oh, there's a little bonfire thing over here. Oh, well, I guess I'm down here now. That's a new shell. That's a purple-eyed enemy. Oh, wait, different shells have different weights indicated by the letter on their stat sheet. A heavier shell might make might take more hits, but it'll also slow down your dodge roll, making it harder to avoid attacks. Uh -huh. All right, big boy, let's do this. Wow. I really does have so much shell strength. Nice, okay. He had purple eyes, so I get an umami crystal. Yay! Comb over three tangled in the net. Oh, no. <laughs> Busy day, but I have about 30 minutes to rest before martial arts. Oh, have fun. I hope martial arts go well today. I'm getting almost decent at the parry. I tell you what. I just parried that guy three times in a row. I'm actually a master of the parry. They call me Master Perry. They call me the furniture for a reason? I I am gonna also need the explanation on that one. Thank you. <laughs> Prime partying after hours. Oh no. Crime J scuttling. Oh my goodness. I'm starting to think that our Duchess might not be the uh, 
upstanding citizen she pretends to be. A lot of, a lot of dead folks around here. <laughs> I like that. Open. It won't open from this side. Classic Dark Souls. Roll out. I gotta I gotta try the umami ability on this bad boy. Find me greater foes. Did I miss Oh, it's a a heart. Love that. Love that. Okay. Uh, I think I go over here. Oh, there was definitely a climb up the whole time. I just fell down here and I was like, well, this is my life now. I just parried him accidentally. Get rocked, son. He also dropped a health, which is great because I really needed one. Okay. Touch the current. <laughs> the marine arts? Is Monty Python riding this way? I heard the clip clop of his horse. That's what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a horse on my back. Hit me. Uh, we'll go ahead and level up. I will get more attack to Ooh, I can get significantly more attack damage. We love that. Oh, I can put points in MSG now too, now that I'm actually doing umami attacks. I can do it without feeling bad about it. You there. How dare you try to stab me while I was trying to stab you. Rude dude. Rude and I repeat dude. All right, what was this guy's crime? Crime possession of seaweed. Oh no. The you there is funnier as a crab. <laughs> Where am I supposed to be going? We came from there over to here. There are three dudes over there that I don't believe I've fought. Wait, let's continue this way. I think I want to get over. Oh, I thought I already fought you. You're down there now. You live there now. Congratulations. Enjoy your stay. This is how we got up here. That guy's not happy with me, but he doesn't have purple eyes anymore, so that's cool. Where am I supposed to go? Maybe, maybe it is up here. Maybe I'm supposed to go the other direction. The crabbing is going so well, Ash. I am having such a good time. Seaweed is actually illegal on the seafloor. Just possessing it can cause fights to break out and nobody wants a coral. Speak for yourself. Is that where I'm supposed to go? Oh, well, I guess I'm here. Oh, I was already here though. What am I supposed to do in this place? I figured I was supposed to get to the other side, but now I don't know where the other side is. I, I don't know how to do that is the thing. I see a shortcut over there. I'll just don't know where to go. I don't know. I did beat that boss, yes. He was a tricky one. Ah! 
Okay. We're getting halfway okay at the uh, at the parry. Oh. I should uh, try my ability. Oh! <laughs> I will now be doing this forever. Thank you. Oh, I capsized him. Ah, get out there, Goop. Perfect. Get out there, Goop. Upgrade the shell just a touch. What? That was so rude of you, my man. We could have been friends. I thought you were cool. Oh, wait, there's more up? Did I just miss more up earlier? How'd I pull that one off? <laughs> oh, he got capsized. Incredible. A whelk. A tiny little snail with a surprising affinity for umami. Plus 15% shell spell damage. Love that. Okay, where is your boy supposed to go from here? I see there's an item down there. Oh, oh, I didn't even realize there was a... Okay, I see. There was this. There was a down that went with the up and an item at the end. But I pressed the wrong button to pick up. This crab keeps trying to swamp you for a COVID test. He's weird like that. An invertebrate that snares tiny prey. Oh, speaking of an enemy. <laughs> Snares tiny prey with its many tentacles. I guess we'll go over here. Wait, have I already been up here? Oh, no, 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 no. I've been up to a similar place to here, but not here. Platforming! My greatest weakness! Besides all my other weaknesses. Rockin'. Hey, crab friend. Yeah. What? No! No! Rip. I can. I have some friends attached that I have not, uh... Oh! He gave me a health, though. So that was nice. I have some uh, some things attached. To, I have two stowaways attached. Right now I've got a limpet and a starfish. So plus three vitality and plus two resistance. I could just have straight up plus 10 defense though. That's wild. I kind of want the muscle though. What if we go with the plus 10 defense? What if I just go full attack mode? Oh, I can have a third then. And I can offset the minus MSG there with this guy. Okay, all right. We're cooking, I think? I don't think we're really cooking, but we're, we're cooking. I do also appreciate that falling isn't dying in this game. The, um... There, there was a time of great debate back in the day where when we were playing Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order, the first one, a debate was raged in chat over whether or not falling off of something should count as a death because the game doesn't count it as a death. But some people in the chat said, no, you would die if you fell off of a cliff in real life, so that should be a death. And so I had to turn off the death count for that game. Oh, I forgot he does double attacks. Love that. Big fan. I parried him? Let's go. Get rocked. A whelk. A Lawrence whelk. More like fallen disorder. I mean, it, it really was disorder in the chat. You're correct. <laughs> But did your death count increase, Sister K? That 
That that's the question. Lots of things in game aren't like in real life. Right, exactly. If I get hit with a sword in the arm in real life, I'm probably gonna die. I was team, it doesn't count as a death. But other people were not, and there was just too much argument about it, so we had to stop. This is part of why I don't... Uh! Will that fall all the way down here? Because it's worth it if it does. This this is why I don't trust people to trade goopy mons. Lovely. <laughs> I'll, I'll bite your legs off. I could. I should have done that. I should have bitten Chat's legs off back in the day. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. I gotta be. I gotta be honest. I have complained in the past quite a bit. Quite a bit about water levels and water physics and that kind of stuff. This game actually makes it fun because there's a lot of forgiveness in like this, like the flutter kick that you can do. Sassy, welcome in, how's it going? We're out here crabbing on main. Um, I guess I'm gonna go there and see what's up here. That's a clam. Oh, hey, another blood star limb. Our, so our maximum health increases. Love that. How much did it increase by? Oh, okay. So vitality is health. So that's, oh, okay, 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 okay. You may remember earlier, I was like, our health went up. That's weird. It's because I put on the stowaway that increased vitality. I was not even thinking about that. I'm a silly Sally seahorse. Sassy, how's your Tuesday going? Are you living the dream? I did also realize, Sassy, that I did totally forget to tell everybody that I was just planning on going down to Cedar Point for a day trip. <laughs> that would have probably been helpful information. Did that say aggressive bold? Oh, ag aggressive gold is the color of that. Uh, colored pencil. Oi, crab boy. Hit me. Get parried, son. He he hit me, but uh, I parried him, so who's the real victor here? No, no, no. I am a silly Sally seahorse. I may look like a crab, but I assure you. I'm all seahorse, baby. Yeah, yeah, no worries. I Well, I read through your, your thing and I was like, oh, ooh, oh, I missed a step. That's on me. <laughs> um, is there anything to gain up here? I don't think there is. Because we've already been in this room. Oh, ooh, there's a crystal down here now. Cool. We'll take it. I told Nisk about it. Uh, so the fact that Nisk did not relay that message, uh, I'm going to blame him for it. Mostly because he's not here and he can't say anything. I'm going to assume they didn't put another thing up here, but... YOLO. You got to check, you know? You're never certain until you're certain. That's what they say. That is Nisk. <laughs> yeah, blame Nisk. Her Tuesday's better than her Wednesday. Shortcut discovered. Oh. I could go back to the bonfire, to the current, as they call it. Ah, I got oozed. Oh man, whoever rolled through here really, uh, really did the business. You know what I'm saying? They re they really messed things up. They did the business. I why am I allowed to say things? I shouldn't be. 
Maybe there's something up here now. <laughs> it really does seem like it's kind of built for that cat. Like we're just going to put as many absurdist situations in front of Goop as possible and let him just say whatever dumb silly thing <laughs> he wants. Hello. My ace man, my mellow. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Bam. This guy's left handed. Most of these guys have been right handed. What? Crab goop, what are you doing? There we go. <laughs> Oh my goodness. This this game is like weirdly dark. Duchess! Duchess! Hey, I don't know if you noticed, but your guards are going nuts out there. Oh, <laughs> Clontre, little hermit. Oh, Clontre. Oh, my oh no. Clear as crystal now. Oh no, am I going to have to fight her? Shuck. Oh, shuck. I once thought my duchy Beautiful, you know, worth preserving. But compared to the reefs, it's a shameful, transient thing destined to wash away. Well, that's why I'm having them tear it down. Oh, I thought my beauty worth preserving too. But of course, my worthless life will wash away as easily as oh, any goodness. other. Oh, goodness. Little hermit. Oh boy. <laughs> Tyrant of Slack Time. Oh, that was an undodgeable or unblockable. Oh, oh, she caught me in the Nar. Oh, I can't leave. Your death will be gorgeous. It, it sure was. <laughs> okay, so I can't leave in the middle of the fight, it turns out. It's a, it's a, yeah, a tea infuser. Sheesh. Steeper. Yeah, she got madge. She got big angry. All right, babe. Well, let's, I kind of want to know what the teacup does. Defense 40, wait, small, morning buzz? I'm interested. I'm going to stick with the coconut. I'm going to swap back to that when I need it. When I need it. Hey, I don't know if you noticed, but your guards are going. Get her. Oh, I tried to dodge and block and Oh shoot. Okay, okay, okay. That little red icon is so small. Oh, you know what? I am I am under understanding some things. That is a long range attack, it turns out. Oh, I dodged it just in time. Lady, stop throwing up. Oh, goodness. So that apparently just, uh. Oh, I'm not trying to get oozed. I'm not trying to get oozed. I, I think I got oozed. I did get oozed. I got gunked. Y'all ever get gunked? Shirley, have a good one. Thanks for being here. All right. At least my, uh, my shell recovers. All right. She's a tricky one.
Oh, why is that so hard to dodge? Your death will be gorgeous. My death will be gorgeous. I parried her. I parried her and she threw up on me. I dodged just barely. Stop throwing up! It's yucky. Oh, I parried that! Cool. Can't believe that worked. I parried it back into her face! That's incredible! Oh, wait. Okay, some attacks. You do have to... I, oh, I can't believe that keeps firing the wrong direction. Yeah. What? I hate that that hit me. She's so yucky. What? I swamped the jump, yo. Ah, oh, my shell broke. Okay, that was a tricky fight. Oh my goodness. You'll see one day. Pollution scoured, praise the reef. Am I right? You're blinking like a Fitbit? Do Fitbits blink? <laughs> the coconut couldn't, but the soda can. Somebody please ban Bellarum! Exclamation ban. Uh, get him there. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was a fun fight. That's hard. She's yucky. But like the satisfaction of parrying grabs, some of grabs, her abilities grabs, was grabs, mwah, grabs, top tier. Grabs, grabs, Thank you grabs, so much, y'all. Grabs, 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 grabs. Oyster shells. Oyster shells. Grabs, 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 grabs. <laughs> no, man. Thank you for the 12 crab bitties. I appreciate it. <laughs> I told T this morning, I was like, I'm getting rich today on crab bitties. That's the only reason I'm playing this game. I don't even like crabs, but I like capitalism. So I'm here to bait people. <laughs> I've been, uh, I've been found out. And by I've been found out, I mean, I openly admitted to it. <laughs> crabating, that crabate, I should have gone with crabating. I'm something of a of a crab sell out, sell out shell out. I'm the sell out, and I'd like you to shell out. <laughs> uh, Ash, I think you, I think you nailed it with that one. Honestly, <laughs> nothing has affected the recent culture of this stream as much as that uh, that alert sound. I don't even like crabs, but I like capitalism. <laughs> <laughs> massive alert impact. That's what they say. As a massive, I'm I'm experiencing a massive alert attack. Subjugate enemies in front of you with a massive swipe of a dungan dungeness dungeness. I'm gonna go with dungeness crab's claw, causing them to briefly take increased damage from all sources. Okay, so I, that's an ability that I just got. Holy abalone! Oh, my friend. 
That was a shell of a fight, kid. Y you, you were watching the whole thing? I guess it was too much to ask that the soldiers caught you, you jerk. Ha ha, no such luck. I hit as soon as everyone started going crazy. A survivor never picks a fight, he doesn't have to. You could learn a thing or two from a guy like me. Well, now the Duchess is, y you know. So give me my shell back. You have no reason to keep it anymore, right? Mm, this old thing? You know, I can barely remember how I got my fins on it anymore. Thinking I might just go pawn this off in the big city, make myself a few microplastics. What? Y you can't do that. A hustler can do anything he wants. Uh, a hustler can do anything he can get away with, kid. An important distinction there. See me in New Carcinia if you want. <laughs> new Carcinia? See me in New Carcinia if you want to buy this bad boy back from me. If no one else buys it first, that is. <laughs> no! No! When I get my hands on that guy, I swear I'm gonna... Ah! I've gotta find a way after him. They should just let me voice act these games. <laughs> power runs through you. You have learned your first adaptation, an attack learned from a powerful creature that can be used even without a shell equipped. Use it with right trigger at the cost of umami charges. Okay, cool. So I can paunch now? Oh, I can for real paunch. Y'all see that? Oh, it takes two charges, though. I'm still mad about the coconut couldn't, but the soda can. <laughs> Surely gonna get his hand, his claws, his claws on him? Really krilling your vibe. Why, did he use Destructo Disc? Why are you mad about it? Because I didn't make that joke. Go watch, go watch my... <laughs> Go watch the TikTok that I posted yesterday and hear my pun about Stay Puff Marshmallow Manning up. You'll understand why I'm upset. <laughs> why is anybody mad about any joke? It's because they were sad they couldn't make it first. I have 4,000 microplastics. I could up my MSG. I think we up our MSG. Yeah. We need more monosodium glutamate. 64F? Ash, I have bad news for you. Today is one of the cooler days of the past five. I don't, I'm not trying to dox myself that hard. It's, it's 81 degrees here. It's a high of 86 today. I lied. It's about just as, as warm as it was the last couple of days here. <laughs> yeah, high of 86 for today. Complex, how's it going? Welcome in. Complex, what do you know about the weather in my area? <laughs> the joke is that Complex is my next door neighbor. <laughs> I'm just guessing. <laughs> So, uh, so in the in the U.S., obviously we have a, a wide range of of climes, right? Uh, and if you're in the if you're in the Southwest, the the meme is, oh, but you don't feel the heat. It's a dry heat. It's a dry heat. It doesn't feel hot. It's a dry heat. And then you go somewhere like Florida, and it's so humid, and you're like, Ugh. gross. It's pretty. It's pretty warm and humid out here today. Um, do we just shell a port out of here? Or do we just roll through? We probably shell a port out, right? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna shell a port to the snail. Oh, it's even glowing. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go to my snail buddy. <laughs> I've been uh I've been messing with T lately cuz she's she really hates the winter. She really hates the winter and anytime it's been even a little bit warm like when it was like 65 degrees out here, I was like, "Oh, this oppressive heat, bring back the winter, bring back the cold." And she was mad about it. Generous as ever, the noble moon snail provides their pupil with additional powers. 
Generous as ever. I have 42 points here. <gasps> Plunging attack. I said earlier that I want one of these. Press left trigger to throw your fork at enemies to reel them in at the cost of a barbed hook. Be careful. Larger enemies will put up a fight. So it cost me an item, but I get a pull attack. I get to blitzcrank people. Yeah, it's a dry heat. Yeah, hum humidity sucks. Like, I, I've done the thing before. Somebody sent me a picture once of the outside of the Orlando, Florida airport. And I was like, oh, I can feel this picture. <laughs> I can feel what it feels like to walk out of the nice air-conditioned airport into the Florida humidity. Blech. Each shell spell may be cast once for free. Okay, this is what I want, actually. As this world crumbles, all living things yearn for home. For most, that home is a place that no longer exists. For some, it is a place that never existed. That's deep shell. Wait, that's deep moon snail. Such is the plight of the hermits, forever unsatisfied, forever yearning. Forever yearning. Any yearners in the chat? Am I allowed to say that? Anyone in the chat yearning today? <laughs> I guess I just dip out. But first. Oh, and I can use one of these for free. Okay, I see the free one now in the lower left there. We love it. We're going to Florida for the 4th of July and I'm not looking forward to the heat. Definitely don't miss that about Okinawa. Did you used to live in Okinawa? That's wild. Humid hot is like putting on wet socks, but in the heat. Ugh, yuck. Yuck. <laughs> you go in the shade and dry heat and it's like 30 degrees cooler. Humid heat shade does nothing. Yeah, yeah. You still feel that like blanket around you. Blech. Wait, Carl Johan, are you in the the Orlando, Florida airport right now? <laughs> Yearning for a learning. Learning is learning. We learned that yesterday. I was in Thailand during rainy season. Every time I took two steps out of my room, sweaty instant. Oh, yeah. Oh, in Oregon for the 4th of July last year and we had to sit in the sun. We died. Oregon isn't even known for its heat. <laughs> There for three years, mostly stayed inside because the humidity was insane. Wow. I didn't know that. That is wild. All right. Let's shell a port. Um, I don't know where to shell a port to. I guess Central Shallows? Let's do it. Okay. Oh, there was a place over here that I wanted to check out where we saw a hook. Bermuda was the hottest human place I've been. I thought people wearing pants were insane, right? And the like the locals are just used to it. Boop boop boop. Hey y'all. Oh, I should have, I should have charged up another one. Let me get one more hit here. I want to hit him with the big, I want to hit him with the claw. Oh, sir. Come here. Come here. I got something for you. It's a treat. I promise you're going to love it. Uh, I guess I'll do this. <laughs> He's stuck. He <laughs> can't get down. We'll just have to uh, take him out the old-fashioned way with bubbles. Okay. <laughs> Found a pair of shorts that fit me, though, for martial arts, so that's good. Hey, that's what's up. Bubbles. 
Little item. Love it. Big fan, big fan. Pig fan, according to TikTok. The auto captions got me. Hair claw. A small chunk of plastic and metal in the shape of a crab's claw must be worth a lot. Traded in for 2,500 microplastics. All right. I will. Once I figure out how to trade it in for microplastics. This to get up to here. Okay. Lovely. All right, somebody come here. Oh, there's another puffer fish over there. Get parried. Call me Sekiro Shadows Die Twice, because I have learned how to parry. <laughs> a sponge! An absorbent yellow and porous specimen. <laughs> absorbent and yellow and porous is this sponge. Plus 33% umami regeneration from attacking. Ooh, but it takes 18 MSG. Okay. I think we can make that happen. Ow. Ah! Oh, uh, well... Hold on. It, it's kind of fine, I guess. Is there a shell around here I can pilfer? Eight. No worries. <laughs> a meeting to play charades? Is everything okay, Bellarum? Is this a cry for help? Is this a cry for kelp? <laughs> Enjoy your lurk, though. On a more serious note, please. Enjoy your lurk. Woo! Oh, I, I almost jumped right off of that. Another crab! The size of a crab knows no upper or lower bounds. Revives you once upon death at the cost of this stowaway. Oh. oh. There are rings like that in Dark Souls. So I just found another crab. Incredible. Incredible. Uh, can I find... Whoa, that guy's got a bike lock. Can I find a shell, please? Please. It's so small. Can, for real, can I get a, a shell, though? Hello? Shells? There are none over here. Is this just like the starting area where there are no? Oh, I can't block when I don't have a shell. I think I just need to run up this way. <laughs> F in the chat for shells. There's none. I have to play through the rest of the game with no shell. I bet you a buck and a half there's going to be a speedrun category for this game that's no shell. The classic no shell category. Here we go. Okay, wait. I kind of want to go fight the guy with the bike lock, though. <laughs> Why did the crab cross the road? He is a tax fugitive. That's right. Just stepped outside for a quick second during my lunch break. It's so muggy and hot out. Oh, happy to be inside today. T uh, has traveled north to the town where her office is for the day. Tax fugitive. Aw, oh, yeah. Oi. Oi. <laughs> Crabspin.gif. Gif? Who am I? Crabspin.gif. Where'd the bike lock guy go? Wasn't he over here? Did I hallucinate that? Is he back here? Wait, this is where the game starts. I must have gone the wrong direction. It's got to be over this way then. Is it a long commute? It's about two hours. Grabs, 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 Oyster shells, crabs, 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 
crabspin.gif. <laughs> Ash, thank you for the 12 crabspin.gif biddies. Oh, he's a boss! music though <laughs> got rolled oh my shell broke I thought I parried him but it was actually just my shell straight up breaking oh no oh no oh he has a gear the the bike lock is a guillotine Excuse? Oh, grabs, I tried to grabs, dodge that. Grabs, I just grabs, didn't. Grabs, 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 grabs. This guy is tanky. Oyster shell. Grabs, grabs. Crabs, 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 crabs. Crabs spin Ow! Ow, ow! I was like, I know I can capsize him. Did that not do any damage to him? Or did I hallucinate that? Oh, no, I'm dead. He puts you in a freaking git. Oh, it blackouts. <laughs> no. That's brutal, actually. Sheesh. Wait, did it say gif or jif? All right, we can do this. I believe in us. He is a tough shrimp. It did almost no damage to him. What was Oyster that? Shells. Oyster shells. Crabs. 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 Ash, thank you for the 12 quabs, biddies. <laughs> Appreciate ya. <laughs> Have fun in martial arts. I hope it's a good time. My shell is badly damaged. I dodged that at like just the last second. Ow! What? What was it? Wait, what is that blue bar at the bottom? Is he in a rage? What's going on? Oh, oh. Okay, wait, I'm okay. There was another shell around here somewhere. There it is. I'm just gonna book it. This dude's a tough cookie. Hey, Nomad, enjoy your lunch. I hope it goes well. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. 
I'm out of juice. Okay, we got some real damage down there. Oh! Ooh. Still don't know what that does. I assume it's some kind of buff for him though. Like two more hits maybe? One more? Yeah, okay, there we go. Oh, wait, it healed me and then I healed myself. Pollution scoured, let's go. Sheesh, a wild Goobymon appeared. It's a walking the tango, exclamation, catch to catch. Never mind, Sassy sniped it. Nice work. Walking the tango is a good name. What a, what a wild one. Close claw, a hefty chunk of plastic in the shape of a crab's claw. You could get some real money for this. Trade it in for a thousand microplastics. I just got to figure out where to trade in my microplastics. Also, what's the ability on the banana peel? Munch? Oh, did I eat that for health? Oh, I wish I had known that 30 seconds ago. <laughs> I don't think he was protecting anything. I think he was just like a boss to fight for the reward of fighting him. He gave you like the lots of microplastics at the end. Interesting. <laughs> okay, we'll put on a fresh shell. A fresh shell, words are hard. I don't know if we knew that. That is a white claw. It is a fight claw. Raw seltzer. <laughs> it's garlic butter flavored. 3% fun per volume, 100 calories and gluten-free. Let me out, I can't jump, hello? There we go. Doctored sparkling water featuring monosodium glutamate. Okay, it's got the MSG, we love that. Okay, where am I even supposed to be going? We fought that, dude. I saw there was some stuff to like grapple to over here. Maybe this is a good idea. I'm just a crab and life is a nightmare. Oh. Can't quite make that. If I go over here, maybe I can? Whoa, buddy. You relax, you. Oh, you're, I can just, I can take care of you so easy, buddy. I don't need to worry about you, crab boy. Follow up on the gift gif pronunciation. Creative the Choosy developers, he reportedly said, choose Jif. <laughs> That's funny. Comedy. Okay. This guy seems angry. I say we give him the claw. Whoop, lovely. Well, that was actually pretty solid. I'm getting the hang of fighting, I think. Which I am very glad for. Is this guy charging all the way over to me or is he he's just going somewhere else? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. He doesn't want the smoke, I get it.
Oh, nice. Okay, I wasn't sure if I was going to make that. But we get some more umami crystals. And we probably don't make it back that way. So, we have to go this way. Oh, and I missed an item earlier. So, glad we came back. I am a little bit confused on where I'm supposed to be going right now, but I am still overall quite enchanted by this. Although I do wish that I could climb up ledges. <laughs> that would be nice. That was very rude. I pressed one little button and my mom got scared. See you later, fish. Okay. I'm curious how long this game is. Because, like, so far, lovely experience. Is this going to be, like, a one more stream game? Is it going to be, like, a month long? I have no clue. I guess there are websites that tell you how long it typically takes to beat things. But I've also found that those tend not to be a great judge for me because I do get distracted and do all of the completionist things. <laughs> GIF is the final format. GIF is the cultural phenomenon that internet culture has turned the format into. Ah, I respect that. I think it, like at the end of the day for me, it comes down to like, one, I mean, it doesn't matter how it's pronounced, <laughs> right? Like, like if we're just gonna be pedantic about things, there are so many things we can be pedantic uh, about. Uh, but two, I think at the end of the day, uh, hold on, let me beat up this lobster for just a second. And by beat up this lobster, I mean get beat up by this lobster. Um, uh, at the end of the day, uh, John Green likes to say books belong to their readers, right? So like the people who are using the thing are the ones who eventually dictate what the thing is. And so, like, if people are saying GIF, then it's GIF. If people are saying GIF, then it's GIF. Ow. I pretty wholeheartedly disagree with, like, the creator of a thing decided that something should be one way, and so, like, that's the meaning it has to have for everybody. <laughs> I do also lean really heavily into the just typing out is it gif or gif <laughs> with no no separate spelling. Oh, I personally say gif. Oh, you say gif? Oh, we can't be friends then. <laughs> I personally uh, say graphics interchange format every time. <laughs> Ah, wait, no! <laughs> I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I just wanted the heart. No Gert feelings. <laughs> I guess, like, for me, uh, like, what? What's the point of what? What's the point of of the debate? Like, what's the point of how you pronounce that? You know? Because the, the answer 90% of the time is going to be people just like to feel like they're right about things and that's silly. <laughs> it doesn't matter. So many things are that way too. Like if I, if I had a dollar for every person I knew in college whose like entire personality what hinged entirely on dying on silly hills? Oh, I'd I'd have several dollars. How you pronounce cr crackers? <laughs> Give him the claw. <laughs> These guys are tricky just because of their attack pattern. Ow, that's my shell. Ow, what? 
I thought I was far enough away, but apparently, apparently not. <laughs> Chex or Kex? Oh, I was so far away. All right, I uh, got to figure out how to get back to there. And then I have to figure out how to get to the big city, I guess. Oh, I also need a shell. I got to fight with dodge rolls for once. Which is so funny because I never used to dodge roll. And now it's like all I do. Okay. How do we get there? Bam, 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 bam. Tomato, tomato. Personally, I say Timmy Toms. That's not true. I actually, I've never met anybody who says tomato. <laughs> I guess it might be an English pronunciation. Around these parts, we say tomato. <laughs> Personally, I say maters. Sand dollar, a little guy that looks like a coin, vanishes on death but prevents you from losing microplastics. That's fun. Uh, I need to go there. If I get one more point in attack, I will kill those guys in two shots instead of three. And that will be lovely. Tomatoes. I love me some tomatoes. You know what? That's true. I do enjoy tomatoes, and I used to be like a no tomatoes ever kind of kind of guy, especially when I was a young warthog. When I was a young warthog, oh, I'm gonna have to fight this guy again. What a turd burglar! When he was a young warthog. I don't know if he takes extra damage after he's been hit by the claw. I apparently did not read the thing well enough. I, I parried him and then he glitched through the floor. What a time to be alive. I almost died for that. I would have been sad. I haven't like lost, lost my microplastics yet. So that's pretty fly. I'm going to switch to this new can. And then I had to go through here, right? Oh, hello, sir. Harry. Oh, me. Relax. <laughs> the bubbles can seem to confuse them. <laughs> I don't know what this glitch is, but it's very funny. Go. All right, crab boy, you're next. I keep forgetting that I can't just stagger those guys on every hit. Red claw. All right, just this once, I'll go all out. Now, this guy's very aggro. Leave me alone. I just want to do the Sudoku and move on with my day. I want to grow tomatoes because fresh tomatoes are delicious, but I kill every plant. I feel that. I have never, never been good at keeping plants alive. Ow. So rude. What did I ever do to you two? Mm. 
going to eat that up for sure. Come here. Give him the claw. There we go. Jeez. Okay. Uh, they were over on the other side of this, I believe. Let's cruise around here. Lovely. Keep schmoovin'. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's over there. These puffer fishes are hard to fight. Fishes? Puffer fishes? Puffer fish? Puffer fish eye? Oh, this one specifically has the purple eyes, which means it's harder to kill. Although, if it does that... That, if it does that, it's real easy. <laughs> if it like slams itself down and glitches through the floor, we'll take it. Which is a sentence I say far too often. And I get a uh, free party hat out of it, so we'll take that. Oh, hello. A chip claw. A chunk of plastic in the shape of a crab's claw. It's definitely worth something. Trade it in for 500 micro microplastics. Mycoplastics. Uh... Okay. It looks like I can get up there. Whoa, 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 wow, wow. That was not what I wanted. I guess we'll try again. We are hitting that like 1 p.m. wall. Oh, hold on. Can't trick me, I saw you. Okay, I just gotta figure out how to get up to there. Aha, perhaps the claw. Lovely. <laughs> I like that the colored pencils all have really aggressive names. Like the, the gold was called aggressive gold. These ones are called belligerent blue. <laughs> Perfect. I think a coffee might be in order. Oh, I can sit. Sit and admire the kingdom. The duchy, I guess? Oh, lovely. One of these days, one of these clams is gonna be a mimic and that's gonna crush me. Probably literally. Okay. So this is what there was up here. I don't think I'm going to find anything else really worth getting. Way too much turkey on your sandwich. I have that problem all the time. I'm like, okay, I just need a little bit of food for, for energy. And then I uh, definitely overeat. I don't know why these guys get knocked through the floor so easily. Goodbye. You give me a crystal? Yeah, thank you. I probably got two level ups. Maybe not. Maybe the, the going rate has increased. I bet it has. I definitely do the thing where like, I'll be done with my meal and I'm like, all right, I'm done. I'm not eating anymore. And then the food just sits in front of me that's left. And I'm like, well, I'll just snack a little bit. It's not that much. <laughs> it's not that much. I'm just snacking. Goodbye. Ooh, thank you. Oh, helpful. Okay, I do gotta figure out where I'm supposed to go. Earlier, Nomad was like, you should just get distracted and have fun. And I was like, bet, <laughs> I'm leaning all the way in. <laughs> right, yeah, then I spend the rest of the afternoon like, why did I do this? I did this to myself. Oh, just one level up. The going rate has increased. Considerably, actually, we've 
Don't even have that much more. Okay. More damage. More damage. Probably health would be good too, but more damage. <laughs> Mostly more damage. I'm gonna go to the left here because I haven't gone to the left before. Maybe we'll find something worth finding. <laughs> Why is the couch like quicksand? Exactly. I live here now. This is my life. This is my existence. Nothing else matters. Nothing else is real. What is this? Some kind of cavern? Oh, nope. Some kind of invisible wall. What is that over there? Oh, it's a flag. I see. It's the top of a traffic cone. Boom, boom, boom. Beck, how's it going? Welcome in. How's your Tuesday? Okay, nothing over here. We have officially explored. I need to go back to where I fought the captain? Or do I need to go talk to the moon snail again? Will he have something for me? I'm gonna go back over here and if there's nothing, I'll just shell port to where the moon snail is. Maybe he's got answers. Fort slack tide question mark? It didn't have a question mark before. Okay. Lovely, goodbye. Owie, why would you do that to me? So rude of you, so rude. Okay. This looks mostly the same. Mostly. I'm a little bit nervous. The question mark really, uh, really set me off. I've got no clue what it means. And it just put anxiety into my chest. This is where we fought the captain. Can I just keep going here now? No, still invisible wall. All right, I think I gotta go talk to the moon snail, but I'm gonna I'm gonna check one last place first. I gotta go talk to the moon snail. A shockingly common thing for me to say. There's all those starfish. This is the place where I can't jump to my death. Good. Glad it's still that way. I bet this is going to be a wild speed run. Oh, you can't even go past the machine. Okay. All right. Um, I guess we'll shell a port back to the moon's now. I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but sure. I don't, I don't think I can go anywhere directly from here. So it's gotta be like a, like a thing where I just need to talk to him about it, I guess. 
His spirit full to bursting. The hermit crab is ready for more power. I can get more abilities. After your shell takes a hit while blocking, your next attack deals increased damage. That's nice. Repost. After parrying an enemy, quickly press right bumper to perform a counter attack. Landing repost restores a single umami. Ch this is the one that I want. The hermit crab's control over his shell does not stop with deflecting attacks. By redirecting their energy, he turns his opponent's strikes into his own. Such in-depth battle strategy is rare in the ocean. Praise be to the noble moon snail who taught him everything he knows. Thanks, the moon snail. Nice. A successful parry. Be careful, you aren't invincible during this attack and other enemies could knock you out of it. That's gonna happen to me at some point. I'm going to be very upset. I don't understand where I'm supposed to go. My man said meet me in the big city. And I don't know how to get there. Teleport. Is there somewhere I can go from the Duchess's chambers? Maybe? I guess we'll go back there and poke around and see if we can find anything. How do I get to where the man wants me to go? Oh, if I would have just walked out, a door would have opened up immediately. <laughs> I've been spinning my wheels trying to figure out where to go. And it was right in front of me. I love it. Perfect. Okay. Oh, there's a crystal over there. We love that. There's a nice sculpture here. Why do I feel like when I destroy the crystal here, it will send that upward? This is a big crystal. I feel like they're usually not this big, question mark. Yeah, that gave me a bunch. Okay. Uh, I'm just looking for anything there is to find down here. It just loops all the way around. Okay. Neato. Enjoy your lurk, Red Zero. Thanks for being here. I appreciate you. Oh, I can destroy the statues. Great. All right. Well, up we go. Crap, 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 crap. Okay, is this where the shark guy was? It is. <laughs> I like she's got a fan. Crabs, 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 oyster shells, oyster shells, crabs, 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 crabs. Biohazard, thank you for the twelve crab biddies. I appreciate ya. I think I was already in here, right? I think I was. I think just this wasn't open before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to go through a side door. Now this is just open. That's pretty good for us, I think. I don't think there's anything to jump down to from there or from here. I could take a nap. <laughs> I think I am going to go make another coffee before I move any further on. Uh, give me one second. I'll be right back. Onward to the big city. I'm going to become a big... Oh, wait. <laughs> I'm not showing the game. Onward to the big city. I'm becoming a big city crab. 
<laughs> if you find yourself dying a lot, it might be because you're not very good at the game yet. Harsh but fair, sir. Harsh but fair. All right, let's see what the big city's got for us. I'm on the road to Viridian City. Why does this look like a, a cart up here? Like a horse-drawn cart? Will you be my friend? I like your cup. It's over. It's all over. Why ain't it ever me, you know? Wow, what's going on here? I'll tell you what's going on. I'm getting my carapace cracked by cruel, unfeeling forces beyond my control yet again. That's what's going on. I just spent my whole savings on rare trash you can only get in the shallows. So I could sell it at a profit in New Carcinia, of course. And then use that profit to trade up my shell. Get myself something nice, you know? And now I come back here and the bridge to the city is completely collapsed. There's no way I can make it back without leaving all this trash behind. It's all over, man. I'm fully shucked. I'll be shellless within the tide. I guess I'd better find a, another way around if I want to get to the city. Thanks for the sympathy, pal. <laughs> Look at all this rare trash that I saw so much of. Wrong way indeed. Uh, but I can sit. Can I just go down here? Ah! No, I cannot, in fact. <laughs> Okay. Uh, oh, there's an item back here that I missed. It looks like there's a way back here. Sometimes you just fall off of a bridge. It's fine. It happens to the best of us. Oh, this is very colorful. Wham, 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 wham. Woo! Okay. A stainless relic. A workable piece of metal. Maybe someone can turn it into something useful. Ooh. Maybe. Maybe, baby. Okay. Is this just where I came from, or is this something else? Oh. It's me falling, but not to my death this time, thankfully. And we get another rest spot. Beautiful. Reef's Edge. Oh, I'm gonna get new shell types here, aren't I? Beautiful. Head on in. Okay. I've heard good things about the reef. Sauce nozzle. Oh my god, it's a sriracha cap. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Oh, incredible. Oh, incredible. I'm so excited. Come here. <laughs> cool. Cool. Rock and roll. <laughs> uh, where to now, though? I don't even see where I can go. Unless that stuff is climbable? Which I'm gonna assume it's not. Uh, hello? I guess we'll give it a go. It's not climbable, in fact. Give, uh, mark another one down for a goop fell to his death. <laughs> There's an item up there. So I have to be able to like get up here or something. Wait, is this like precision platforming? No. How do I get up there? Oh, sponges are bouncy. That makes sense. Seahorse. Angry seahorse. Oh, it makes cute noises. I don't love that. I wish it didn't make cute noises. <laughs> it would make me feel better about, you know, the murder. Oh, I, I should try the, um, the repost thing. 
Okay. My shell is almost broken. And now it is broken. Lovely. Uh, where can I find a new one? Why are these things so hard to fight? There we go. Just knock him out with the claw. We might as well. At least I get the party hat back. Does that guy have a, an olive skewer? Oh. Well, my shell broke. Uh, but so did that guy's whole body. So we'll take it, I guess? Fantastic. These two look like buddies. Oh! <laughs> he hit the sponge and went flying. <laughs> Adorable. Ah, there's the repose. Oh! First of all, this. Second of all, shot glass. Love it, love it, big fan. Hiya! Perfect. Oh! Okay, it turns out jumping into an urchin. Ba bad idea. There's a crab up there trying to murder me. Murder in this economy? Didn't have it. Oh, but it did so much damage to me. I am nearly dead. Uh, oh! Mm. <laughs> now I'm for real dead. <laughs> Ouch. Fair enough. Ooh, but I do get to get back to the sauce cap shell. And uh, that I'm about. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, oh, that was almost bad. Well, oh, come on, what the heck? <laughs> I had like a little bit of momentum and just couldn't stop, I guess. Why, why is it not targeting the one right in front of me? Come on. That was good. Lovely. Oh, I see. He intentionally jumps back onto the sponge. Oh. Try that again. Boom. There we go. Okay, the repost is very fun. Big fan of that. You want to attack? Beautiful. I would love if that. Whoa. What? Since when do you have a ranged projectile? Does he have a thing of tic tacs attached to him? He does. Huh? That's so silly. I have to fight this guy again. Why, though? Okay, wait, that was actually the cleanest fight I've ever done. 
in my entire life. That was the one. A wild Goopymon appeared. It's a Nisk hands. <laughs> Hang on, I gotta send a picture of that to Nisk. Incredible. Exclamation catch to catch that bad boy. Okay. Ow. My shell. Hang on. Oh, there's like not. Okay, this will work. Ow. What? Bro. Will you get lost? Stop it with the sponge thing too. Jerk. Can I not get that? Okay, I got it. Just barely though. Okay, give me the shot class for sure. We'll take it. Woo! Yo, nice catch, Beck! Give him the claw! Oh, he dropped a thimble. I'm gonna recover my junk. Wait. Oh, it's a two star shell? Like the coconut was. It's got like a nice ombre pattern to it. That's very fun. Okay, how do I get where I'm going? How's everyone's Tuesday going so far? It's the afternoon, we're trucking through. Oh, we're right at the part where the day starts to feel long for me. I love that these guys keep dropping health. <gasps> that was so rude. That was so rude. Get lost, seahorse. Well, we'll take that. He fell to his death and I got 300 microplastics for it. We'll take it. Um, I think I stick with the one that I currently have. And I also take this, cause that's clutch. Hey, back, have a good one. Thanks for stopping in, I appreciate you. What is that cube over there? Huh? Oh, I guess I'm supposed to go that way. I thought this way would have been the way to go. But I guess not. Well, I kind of want to check that out over there. This looks like maybe it's like an item spot. Let's fortify. Yeah, oh, I nailed that one. There we go. Ow, 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 ow. Let me eat, please, thank you. Hey, you. Get knocked, silly pants. See, the funny thing is he's not wearing pants. He's a crab. Gotta love all the microplastics. A one of a kind sentence for this game. <laughs> I got a sea star. Yeah, let's hop down here, I guess. Oh. 
Oh, I knocked him right off the edge. Perfection. What in the world? Why are there so Yo! many Yo! Too, hey! Too many boys. Everybody listen I'll up. I'll fight a crab. On our shore. Grab your weapons. Time to defend board the windows and doors. We need to push these raiders back. Knock them down to the floor. Then we'll throw them to the wall. Exclamation defense in the chat. We must defend. We must defend. We must defend. Till these dastardly raiders meet their end. We must defend. We must defend. Send them straight back to the evil place they... Oh, what is that? Never mind, they're friends. Yo, Luminary VT. Is that VTuber or are you from Vermont? <laughs> Either way, welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. Oh my goodness. Oh, is it your first day as well? Ah, oh, love it. Freaking love it. And like, when this game popped up, somebody told me about it. They were like, there's a Crab Souls. Like, I was like, I was like, there's no way. <laughs> it seems like it panders to me so incredibly hard. <laughs> <laughs> the worst. Ah, oh, so many silly things. Sandational. Uh, it, also, Bellarm, I just want to give everyone who just came in fair warning. Um, Bellarm has been having a field day with puns in this game. So uh, if that's not what you're into, this might not be the place to hang out. But <laughs> And it must be just about 2 p.m. because all my lights just turned off. You have nice taste in shirts? You're so savage, Red Zero. <laughs> what did I miss from this wonderful, funny, delightful stream? We're all saying mean things about me, Nomad. That's... <laughs> oh, that's the first time you've seen it? Oh, good. I'm glad you liked it. I still haven't played Untitled Goose Game. That's true. I'm a bad man. I'm a bad man and a worse crab. Okay. Let's continue onward. I just love the little way I scuttle around. I just have dad road rage. That's all I got. I'm valid, valid. <laughs> my my dad uh, used to say that anybody who drove faster than him was a maniac. Hey, thanks for. Uh, <laughs> oh God. Hey, he's hey. You just gave someone a sub. You're a baller and a real friend, and I bet they feel the love. Hey, thanks. Ah! <laughs> no, man, thank you for the gift sub. I think you misunderstood the assignment. We were supposed to say mean things. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much for that. Sassy Fanny TV, if you're here, please enjoy those cute cat emotes and also the one that is my wife's face, courtesy of Nomad TL. I really appreciate that so much. Another sassy WTF2 sassies? This is getting out of hand. Funny enough, I still haven't seen a second Goopus McGurg. Weird. I thought it was a pretty hey, common name, for, but. Uh, oh, God! Hey, hey, you just gave someone oh, a sub. God, that guy hit like a truck. I gotta parry him. Ow! Look at this! Bellarum, thank you for gifting a sub to Luminary. <laughs> Great timing to come back, Blogic. <laughs> that was uh, incredible. I regret somehow everything and nothing at the same time. It's a great day. <laughs> Luminary, please enjoy those cute cat emotes and also the one that is my wife's face. My wife is not in town today, so... The best I've got is her face emote. Get out of here. Get out of here. And you too. Uh, no hiding, Sponge Boy. I like you. <laughs> no, man. Thank you for the seven. I like you, biddies. I like you too. Thanks for being here. I, I know how to say mean things. You're such you're such a savage. No, man. <gasps> Ow. Ah, what? These guys did not attack like this before. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You are canceled. Rude. So rude. There we go. I want to be clear. The seahorses are canceled, not you, Nomad. You're lovely. I appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank <sighs> you. 
Okay, I should just run past this. But how could I? Oh, that repost ability is so fetch, as the kids say. You there! Goodbye. Ah. So I wasn't watching my health bar. <laughs> um, Bellarum, I missed you. Missed a D cup. Well, we we. We, let's make this a team effort. We missed a D cup earlier. Right when you gifted that sub, I fell off the edge and it actually reduced my health bar to zero. So that one does count as a death. <laughs> I am uh, pretty notoriously bad at typing. And I'm definitely notoriously bad at speaking words. So you're, you're in a safe place, Luminary. <laughs> You're not alone. I'm just, I'm just. Hello? Hello? What just happened? I got ya ya yeeted. I'm just gonna keep moving. Oh, I missed it. Oh, my bad. My bad, my bad, my bad. That time I blocked it, but did not parry it. I was I was trying for the parry repost. It did not work. Such is life. That's the first time that I have actually lost my microplastics. Like, I have... What? Ah, he does so much damage. Holy moly. Yes, so we should be at 20 right now. Yes, 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 two, two D cups, thank you. Yes. That is correct. <laughs> I'm getting destroyed by the ocean logic and you're like, ah, oh, we, need, we need some ocean songs. Get out of here, crab boy. Quack, quack. Ah, whoop. So rude. You. No, you are not doing that again. Yeah, get out of here. Silly Sally Seahorse. No worries, Luminary. You have a fantastic day. Thank you again for the raid. I appreciate that so much. And uh, yeah, yeah, have a great day. I hope everything goes well for you and uh, I hope you get a $60 raise at your job. There we go. That's what I wanted to do last time. How difficult was that? Okay, all I have to do here is not do the stupid things that I did before. And we should be okay. This guy hits like a truck. And I do not expect it. Every time. No! What in the world? Two guys at the same time is cheating. <laughs> I'm furious about this. I would like to speak to the crab's manager, please. Does anybody know who that is? Heck off. You heck off too. Ooh. <laughs> it's okay, delete quote does work, yes. Exclamation delete quote and then the number should do it. 
No, no, no. No, no, no. You stop that. You're healing? Your three-year-old has been watching with rapt attention. <laughs> Is this a kid-friendly stream? I don't think I ever... Uh, I don't think I ever claimed that. Oh, you must have misheard me. I said this is a squid-friendly stream. There we go. <laughs> I've been canceled so many times. It doesn't matter if I'm a kid-friendly stream or a squid-friendly stream or a stack of ducks in a raincoat, like... None, none of it matters. Give him the claw. Okay, I forgot about the claw and that's on me. That is 100% on me. What are you talking about? This stream is kid friendly. <laughs> Good news, my three year old can't read. Can he not read the things that I'm saying? Oh my goodness, I just realized. Madge, <laughs> Madge about it. I just realized what the, what the seahorses are throwing at people. They're the little like just add water pellet things that turn into little spongies. Something's about to jump out at me, right? Seahorses reminds me of drinking out of cups. Are you okay, Bellarm? <laughs> oh, do you have the headphones on, Cably? That would make sense, I guess. <gasps> I swam to Jom right now. I lived. Oh my god, I'm back with these morons. I am furious. Oh no. Oh no, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I hate it here. Thanks, Bellarum. <laughs> the worst part is you die and like the music is like do 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 do. It's so cheery. I love it here. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> His corpse bounced. What? I'll I'll show you. Not this one, but watch the other guy. They're those little sponge. That one's a dinosaur. The blue one earlier was a pterodactyl. Watch this. Yeah. That's hysterical. That's actually such a funny design. Okay, Goop, take a deep breath. Take a deep breath and fight like you're not a moron. Slam your face down here. Do the thing. There we go. There we go. Ugh. Krill be thimble, Krill be quick, Krill got pwned by a Q-tip. I resent and resemble that quote. 
Get clawed! Oh, well, you're down there. Now. Oh, wait, you're not down there, apparently. Uh, no, I don't know where to go. Run, Goop! There we go. Jeez. I get the thimble. Oh, there's two. Babby. This part is stressful. Junk recovered. It's official. Pro streamer. That's what they say. That's what they say. You want to explode another sponge thing at us? Yep, that one's a little uh, Stegosaurus. I don't wanna like. Stop that, thank you. I do not like this guy. He's just standing there menacingly. Goodbye. I like the little confetti. That was good. I enjoyed that. That was my favorite part of that guy dying. <laughs> Back up we go. I think I just need to like bait this guy. Like last time I tried to jump over him, it did not work. I think we just need to get back to a safer space. Come here, crab Bert. If you could just like fall off the ledge of your own Honda Accord, that would be killer. Oh, 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 we did it. Look at us go. Okay, all right. I think, oh, well, oh, 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 there's a shortcut. Lovely. Okay, perfect. Everything's suddenly good now. There's a party hat over there and a soda can. I don't think that's what I want, but I'm willing to find out. I think I can just go this way and bypass all those dudes. Yeah, 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 perfect. I think that was like a, if you fall down your donk area, like you have to refight through this whole place. Goodbye, Mr. Seahorse. See you in hell. I mean, uh, heck. Oh, see you in the underworld, Mr. Seahorse. I need to get to the seahorse first. What? Are you kidding me? It hit me in the air. <laughs> this is good. This feels good. It hit me in the air and stopped my dash, so I couldn't get to it. What do I what do I do from here? I just die, right? Yeah. I'm gonna heal twice, I guess. What an obnoxious seahorse. Ugh, I just had to like tank the hit. Yeah, come here, buddy. Goodbye. Um, my... Why do I get the feeling he won't get hurt by this thing? Oh, the humanity. You saw a manatee? Goodbye. Can I have the uh, heart though? Thank you. Why do I get the feeling the enemies won't get hurt by the big spiky things, but I will? 
Okay, what is the deal with this guy? Also, how do I get back up? Oh, there's a sponge over there I missed. I kind of want to fight that guy. I also kind of don't want to fight that guy, you know? He's in a precarious place. Oh, never mind. It was easy peasy. I just forgot to turn on my gamer mode. Once I did that, everything was simple. Remind me in the future to do that. If I'm struggling with someone, just something, just say, hey, Goop, uh, maybe throw it in gamer mode. Looks like maybe there's a couple places I can go. Oh, that uh, donks up my umami. I almost said mochi, but that's a different thing. Okay, I'm cool with that, question mark? It feels like there's a way to get up that, but I don't know what it is, so I'm not going to. I still don't know what the big cube things are. They can run, but they can't tie. Do you just have another page open on your browser, Bellarum, that just has ocean puns? <laughs> be honest, be honest. No shame, no shame. Okay, although maybe making it over there would have been a good look. We're gonna continue here. I shall. The amount of like narrow platforming here is ludicrous. I don't think I'm a fan of it. I do want to jump all the way over there, but I don't know what is possibly on that little platform. Oh, it brings you back up. Well, let's figure it out. Let's see what's going to jump out of the ground and murder me over there when I have half of a hit left on my, uh, on my shell. Honestly, incredible. Nobody's ever described me that way. Why does this exist? What What is the point of this? Explain, America. Explain. I see now how you can get up to the top of that. But I don't know how to get over there. Also, there's just a whole interstate sign in the ocean right here. I've run out of original content and the official Ocean Conservancy has a page dedicated to ocean puns. No way. Incredible. Fantastic puns. I'm here for it. I'm giving you the green light. Thank you for supporting the Ocean Conservancy. <laughs> I had a feeling I could get back over to this. Wow. Whoa. He oh, hello, Mr. Snail. Last time I talked to a snail, we ended up beefing over turf. I don't know if that's going to be the case here. Tennis ball. Medium weight. It has rollout like the coconut. We like the coconut. Hey there, pal. Do you like going fast? <laughs> Bablo? No, I hate it. Well, it's your unlucky day, because you're going to need some wicked speed to get over that ramp down there. Walking ain't going to cut it, neither is sprinting even. No, sir. Okay. And that's where I come in, Bablo. Five-time snail racing league champ at your service. It's Turp. No, it's Bablo. I don't know if you... It says his name right on the screen, Bellarum. Come on. <laughs> They had to give us snails our own league because we're so damn fast. 
okay? I'm gonna tell you how to get speed so insane your grandma's antenna will be twisted in her grave. Or maybe she's still alive. Sorry, that was a little insensitive either way. But trust me, this kind of sh movement will peel your gills right back. It'll dry out your exoskeleton while you're still underwater. It'll boil you in your damn shell if you're not careful. And worst of all, it'll turn you into a permanent speed demon who can't even form words if they're not moving at high velocity. Are you ready to accept that kind of a risk? Because a lot of people say they are, and before you know it, bam, addicted to speed. Seen it happen to a lot of good critters down here, so I gotta ask one more time. You sure? Yeah, why not? Okay, so basically you're just gonna wanna sprint towards the ramp and then press the block button. Sprint towards the ramp and press the block button. Okay? Ah! Uh... <laughs> okay, well, we made it. <laughs> that was the speed demon? We're such speed demons, y'all. We did it! We made it to our next little shell. High Velocity was my Cabley's nickname in high school. Your Cabley? <laughs> you probably didn't even notice, Cabley, but you and Bellarum went to high school together. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna increase my life. Seems like the responsible thing to do for once. Okay, how many, uh, how many of the shells have we found? Hang on, let me, let me look at my collection. 12 out of 69. Not bad. We got a long ways to go though. You read the seaweed? Did you read it? Or did you consume it? Be honest, be honest. I don't know, something about this game just feels very joyful to like cruise through all the different places. Even though I'm traipsing through an ocean that is full of trash. I am having such a good time doing it. Oh, you saw the sign? And it opened up your eyes? Uh, before I go talk to that fine gentleman over there, I'm going to look around a little bit. See if I can find any free items, or fritems as the kids call them. Fun fact about seaweed, it's technically not a weed in the sense that weeds are classified as invasive slash harm, harmful species. Uh, can I give a follow-up fun, fun fact about seaweed? Most seaweed salads at restaurants are made of cabbage, not seaweed. I learned that last night. You're very vital and helpful to the fish population. <laughs> there was a sign? I, I did see a sign. New Carcinia. Oh, we made it to the big city. I've been lied to. <laughs> I did not try it, Cably, if I'm being honest. I brought it and I did not try it. Uh, they're asleep. Okay, well, this place is obviously well guarded. You take a good nap, buddy. You've, you've earned it. You deserve it. Into New Carcinia. I've always thought of myself as something of a misplaced big city crab, if I'm being honest. The most tasty thing about that seaweed salad, seaweed salad cable, was that it was completely free. Oh, we're with the bourgeoisie here. Look at these fashion statements. Nice to see a fresh face in town. And right before trash day too. What's trash day? Oh, he doesn't know. He doesn't know what trash day is. I couldn't spoil the surprise for you now. You'll know soon enough. Follow the CVS. Oh, you're right. It is a CVS. This is what Purple Blur was talking about. CND Pharmacy. <laughs> Incredible. Bourgeoisie. I, I get it. I like it. I like it. 
And that is the long, complex history of Slacktide's trade route with New Carcinia. Wow, I'm so glad I stuck around to learn all that lore. Thanks, Uncle Addy. Does it belong in a landfill and not a sea? I mean, honestly. I think we're learning that a lot of things don't belong in a sea fill. Hello there. Um, hello, ma'am. Have you come from Slack Tide? This bridge is usually reserved for traders, soldiers, and nobles, but you don't look like any of those, dear. Unless, perhaps, you're one of those neo-nobles that chooses not to flaunt your wealth. How exciting! What's the Duchess's court like? Is she as gorgeous as they all say? Yeah, she was. I mean, she's pretty. It belongs in a museum. It's a dish sponge street lamp tree? Oh, you're right, it is. That's hysterical. You're not so bad yourself, little noble. Care to come up to my apartment? Oh, baby. She's got cigars on her balcony. Oh, her balcony is an ashtray. And it's held up by cigars as well. Have a nice day, ma'am. How do I, how do I romance? How do I romance the nice crab lady? Let me in. My destiny awaits. Dad ashtray. <laughs> you are very old, Bellarum. Your 38th birthday is coming up, right? This place is huge. <laughs> Enamored with the sight of our fair city. I can honestly say I've never seen anything like it. You should go and explore, but I'd stay topside if I were you. The seabed can host some pretty sketchy characters. Airy Crabiter? All the doors are playing cards. <laughs> I was 38 once in the future. Oh, are we doing the non-linear time thing again? Fair enough. A beacon of civilization amongst the harsh violence of the sands between. I see a gaming keyboard over there. A testament to the prevailing power of industry. The city of dreams, the big crab apple. The big crab apple. And the defining pillar of the trash economy which supports all of crustacean society. How did I get into this conversation? My name you ask? Tortellini, the town greeter at your service. I am beyond excited to greet you two new visit uh, to I'm beyond excited to greet two new visitors in a single day. Is that a lot? Not at all. We usually get 20 or 30. Then why? Wait, did you say two? Was the other one a shark carrying the coolest shell you've ever seen? Oh, a friend of yours? <laughs> Is it half a fortune cookie? <laughs> Not at all. I've got to kick that guy's butt and get my shell back. Oh, -ho, a sworn enemy then. This day gets more exciting by the minute. I've got to catch him before he sells my shell to who knows who. Can you tell me where he went? Not at all. I greeted him with gusto and then didn't give him a second thought. <laughs> what sort of town greeter would I be if I looked behind me to keep tabs on those I've already greeted rather than facing forward to greet those yet to come? Okay, okay, okay. Where would someone trying to sell a shell go then? I can think of exactly four places. They might have tried... There's the gaming keyboard. They might have tried to sell it to Shellfish Desires, the luxury goods store. <laughs> if it's more of an antique shell, they may have gone to check it in the museum, check if the museum curator might purchase it. Failing those, they might have visited Bottom Feeders, the dive bar in the lower crust to try to pass it off to some piece of gutter trash. And finally, they could have gone to the back alley blacksmith to sell it for scrap. Okay, thank you so much. I'll check out all those places. Cod speed, small fry. Would that I could give you more of a tour. But my work is never done whilst there remain travelers left ungreeted. Words are hard. Nice hat. His name is Tortellini. <laughs> I like these film strips <laughs> of cats. It's all pictures of animals. Exceptional. <laughs> what is film? Uh, me too. Me too. The toddler was crabby. <laughs> <laughs> crabby. So she and I took a nap. 
I've been feeling crabby. I could go for a nap. I can't even take my meds. I've been getting headaches. You should take your meds. Uh, you should do exclamation the purple blur in chat. That might help. I've just been unable to stop thinking about that awful business happening in the grove. Would you hush up and enjoy your kelp benedict? All this bleeding heart nonsense is ruining brunch. Yeah, the big CVS receipt that goes through the entire town. <laughs> Wait, I can't sit on these seats? Ridiculous. You have ramen and, and an egg for hair. You see that hermit over there? Isn't he so mysterious? The one standing uncomfortably close to us right now? Heavens no, not them. The mysterious blue one over by the bar. Oh, please don't tell me you mean Firth. Talabia went on a date with him, and he tried to get her to invest in sand dollars. Oh, no. <laughs> you deserve someone better, Delty. Some hard-working crab who will treat you right. But he's just so mysterious. Oh, you're a short little guy, huh? Who's, uh... Where, where's Firth? Oh, this guy. Well, hey there, long time no see, fellow hustler. You're that guy from the bridge. Sure am, Firth's the name. Don't erode it, you know? You, you seem pretty happy. Didn't you just lose all your money? <laughs> of course not, pal, not even close. A shrewd investor never puts all his shells in one, I mean, puts all his butts in one shell, you know? A shrewd investor never puts all his butts in one shell. Somebody write that down, somebody write that down. Like, the, the commentary bell arm is actually incredible. <laughs> the, the way that they've used all of this trash so creatively, I'm obsessed. And that's my goal in life. I get butts into shells. Specifically, my butt. And specifically, the fanciest, flashiest, most impressive shell I possibly can. You feel me? Not really. I'm a shell trader, kid. That's the hermit's lot in life. Always looking to upgrade. Swap out the old shell for a better one. If you're smart, you'll get into the business too. A whole ocean of opportunity could be passing you by, you know? We fight him? It didn't work. Corks? Oh, these are the little cocktail umbrellas. In, uh, spindles. Spools? Spools. Thread spools. He comes from south of Dixie. <laughs> Perfect. Catch the cat. Thank you. Uh, I do love my morning constitution around New Carcinia Square. So says I, Bartleby Shoals. That's Bartleby Shoals if anyone was curious. Oh, you're a big guy. Souvenirs, tchotchkes, miscellaneous baubles of various sizes and quality. Get them at their cheapest right before trash day restock. Another profitable trash day is just ahead of yours truly. The hotel is booked to the gills with eager tourists and I don't even have to lift a pincer. Oh, okay. He didn't want to talk to me. I'm go talk to these folks. Trash futures have never been brighter. I'm positively drowning in the stuff. It's such a rapidly growing market. I simply can't understand how any crab could miss out on these opportunities. Honestly, this makes me want to invest in trash. Should I invest in trash? What do you want? I'm sorry, but I'm a very busy business crab. Very busy with business. Oh, sorry. It looked like to me like you were just standing around. What have you What you have just told me is that you know nothing about doing business. I guess not. <laughs> If that's doing business, I've been doing business all my life. Ha-cha-cha. -cha. I am pro always uh, let the toddler sleep. Yeah, I can't believe we ran into a crypto bro. <laughs> In another crab's treasure. Okay. Why do I feel like I maybe missed a place? Oh, there's shellfish desires. Hold on, there's some stuff to grapple to over here and I'm curious.
What a... What are, what, are we, what are we doing here? Oh, we're going into the underbelly. I see. Cut. Cut. Okay. I have no idea how I'm going to get out of here. Oh, I could go over to that uh, rest point, that shell. And just shell a port back up. Can I walk on these? I can. Handy to dandy. Do I get something for sitting in all the spots where I can sit? What happens if I sit here long enough? <laughs> I mean, if they're telling me that the trash market is booming, should I not believe them? Also, how have I not gotten more outfits? I got this one from the captain at the very beginning and then nothing. You know? I need more fashion. Oh. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Well, that's also not what I wanted to do. Oh. Cool. Oh, well, that's also not what I wanted to do. I didn't want to come down here. There's the um, the blacksmith guy, though. Oh, that fish is just driving a car. Should we launch trash into space? What if we just... Figure out how to not have as much trash. I think like people have talked about launching trash into space before and it, at, at this point at least has gotta be just so prohibitively expensive. Let's go find Shellfish Desires. Where was that? That's the museum. That's Shellfish Desires. There are all these hooks hanging all over. The Elon Musk garbage cannon. Can we also? No. What? Can we also launch Elon? The receipt. There's no better city in the world than New Carcinia. I've never even been anywhere else. That's how great it is. I see that it's a CVS. Oh, CND's nuts. Got him. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> I saw that it said something there, but I was like, ah, oh, you can't even read it. <laughs> All right, let's go see about these shellfish desires. Why does it look like I can take the F as as a shell if I can get up there? Do you think I can? It's flashing like a shell would. Am I going to get an ability later that launches me into the air? I would love to have the F key shell. I think uh, Carcinia is a play on carcinization, which is the um, the tendency for evolutionary evolutionarily words are hard for things to uh, become more crab-like over time. Like, the theory is that as things evolve, they, they turn into the shape of crabs. Welcome to Shellfish Desires, the flagship brick-and-mortar store of Shellfish Corp. How goes it, my visibly financially troubled friend? Is it that obvious? It is! I suppose you've come to the upper crust for a bit of window shopping. No shame in it. Plenty of folks pause on their way through town to take a look at our luxury shells. You've got five minutes before your 
pause becomes a loiter. So enjoy them while they last, my friend. Uh, their hat is an apple. I don't think he just called me poor. I think he called me poor and said he's gonna kick me out if I don't skedaddle fast enough. Did a big shark come into town and try to sell you a shell recently? Oh, he sure did. I told him to get stuffed. We don't do trade-ins here. And even if we did, I'd never take the kind of beat up junk he sold me. Not a clue where he went after that. Does nobody in the city pay any attention? Oh boy. <gasps> I can buy a duck shell? A Felix cube? A shuttlecock? A con... Conchigly? Conchigly? This sorry... Oh, I see. It's it's like a shell like the pasta. It's a pasta shell. This sorry excuse for a shell became flaccid and rubbery as soon as it entered the water. What's the point? Lil bro? Wait. Wait. That's, that's a slow bro tale. A natural seashell with a menacing face carved in. Piggy bank? Imposter. Oh, no. A plush visage of a legendary trader. And a baby shoe. Piece of protective armor never worn by its intended host. They're hitting me with literary references now? I refuse. Oh, geez, there are some expensive ones in here. Made krill? I just cleaned up this mess. Could we keep it clean for 10 minutes? Wait, is this an outfit? It is. A Matryoshka doll, a trophy. Rainbow Crabitalism! Why have I been calling it capitalism when I could have been calling it Crabitalism? This is how I get more fashion, though. That's nice. Mr. Krill? <laughs> Incredible. Cult leader. Oh, Cult of the Lamb reference. Leader followers to glory or certain doom with this fashionable wool getup. Midnight. I don't know what this is a reference to. But the maid outfit, pretty slick. Can I, oh, shell insurance. As shell, shellfish desires, you can pay microplastics to insure any shell you've worn before. At a moon snail shell, you can pick any insured shell to start with every time you respawn. Useful. Oh, that is useful. The coconut would be nice, honestly. All right, nice talking to you. The duck's name is Bartholomew, yes. Right, the baby shoe reference? I mean, it was for sale, never worn. Oh, Jackson. Every day I find myself looking down, wishing you were up here with me, claw and claw. The tide we crossed paths, I was immediately smitten, but my family would never approve of me with a commoner. But there's nothing common about you. Maybe one day I'll possess the courage to tell you, but until then, I shall yearn from afar. Any yearners in the chat, I am asking once again. We found the museum, that's good. Wait, what was, who's there to talk with? Oh. You, down there! Yeah? You are so small! Positively minuscule! A regular little zooplankton! I love it! Have your people contact my people, we simply must do lunch! My people? What are we yearning for? Well, that's, that's, that's a you, that's a you question. What are you yearning for? I, I just love that it's called Rainbow Crabitalism. How am I liking this game so far? I might be a little obsessed. <laughs> I'm glad that it's challenging, too. I'm telling you, dude, ancient civilizations were way more advanced than we thought. They built all sorts of stuff out of the natural environment. They had no need to wait for trash islands to show up. What, like those medieval nutjobs in the shallows? Advanced my shell. No, 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 way cooler than that. They made stuff that still hasn't been recreated today. And they did it with magic. <laughs> all right, I think you need to lay off the seaweed. A simple and happy life. Well, yearn away. I think that's a, a, a lovely thing to yearn for. I'm here to approve of your yearnings. <laughs> ah, Cable yearns for the mines. Mm, just like the children. I get it. I get it. 
Look at that big stupid museum. What's the point of a whole building to store old crap from the past? Call me when they start showing off objects from the future. <laughs> I mean, honestly, valid. No, I, well, that's not what I was saying. I, hey, can I go out this way? No! Uh, okay, okay, I'll go somewhere else. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to snap at you like that. I'm just under a lot of pressure, okay? People are not happy that they can't get to the open ocean right now. They keep calling me names like phoned in progress blocker and saying my fence is lazy design. <laughs> There's a good reason for it. Trash Island is on its way here right now. If we keep all, if we kept all the avenues of transit open during trash day, it'd be a goddamn ship show in here. A goddamn ship show. <laughs> Why can't all these civvies understand that the rules are there for a reason? <laughs> I love the, the self-commentary on the lazy design. <laughs> uh, I could not have written this game better myself. This guy's hat is a chip with a, with a twist tie on it. Oh, and he's holding a flosser. Where's Sister K? She might be at work. She was just talking about how she thinks the second most polluted thing or littered thing must be flossers. Had to send her a snap. Excuse me, what is this building? What ho, little one? You stand before the new Carcinia Museum of Carcinized History, I say. Oh, neat. Could I go in? Apologies, but the museum is currently closed to the public while we put the finishing touches on the new exhibition. Oh. Hey, I'm looking for a tall shark who stole my shell. You seen anyone like that? Hmm, I can't say I have. But if I traveled here to fence stolen goods, I'd start in the lower crust down beneath us. Gotcha, thanks. Be careful down there, I say. Okay, thanks, Mr. Museum Crab Guy. I appreciate you. <laughs> so the thing about Cably not yearning for children. <laughs> ah, whoa. Oh. Well, I fell all the way down. Hey, small fry, word of advice. Don't stick your claws in what's going on here. You owe a lot of plastics, Porg. Is this a Porgy and Bess reference right now? A lot of plastics. You're good for it though, right? Hi, I'm in significant trouble. Do you want me to help with that? No, thank you. I'll never grow as a person if I don't learn to fight my own battles. Okay, hope it goes well. Thanks, it probably won't. This guy's got a ravioli hat. And she's got fusili hair. Incredible, incredible. Hey, Manta? Yeah, Coley? What are we doing? Like right now? Like right now? We're hanging out by the crystal. Hanging out by the crystal? Yeah! You wanna do anything after this? I know another cool crystal on the other side of town. We could go hang out by that. You're the best. Aw, just guys being dudes. Hey, Manta. Yeah, Coley? That guy broke our cool crystal. No way. Just walked right up and broke it. What happened to live and let live, Coley? No idea. Life really isn't what it used to be. Wanna go find another cool crystal? I sure do. Can't let jerks that like that ruin our chill. So true. Just guys being dudes, you know? I love these two. I love these two. A Wait, was it a prawn shop? I totally didn't catch that. It is a prawn shop. <laughs> and it's made out of a recycling bin. <laughs> I hear that the upper crusters technology is way ahead of what we've got down here. Yeah, for sure. I hear that they've got some magic trash that lets them send messages all the way to space and back. I heard that they've already cracked teleportation and they can upload a crab's brain into a totally different body. We are shucked, man. How am I supposed to compete for jobs with a teleporting crab? Ain't no way, ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ah! <laughs> if I recall correctly by mass, the most littered thing in the ocean is fishing nets. 
Oh, that would make sense. I, I believe the most littered thing on the planet are cigarette butts. I, I heard that somewhere. What ho, gentle crab. Uh, hi, how's it going? Truly terrible, but I can't let that keep me down. I have an endeavor that will see me in the big cans at last. It can't possibly fail again. Cably, did you write this character? This feels like you wrote this character. Like you specifically wrote the again on that one. Ding, teleporting crabs, taking our gerbs, turking our gerbs. Honestly, I like it down here where it's dark. Feels cozy, like being under a rock. I just wish the houses didn't get so soggy. That's fair. Lot of cardboard back here. I used to work out in the Vale, sorting garbage for Shellfish Corp. But things outside the reef have been getting scarier lately. Crabs losing their minds. New predators coming in? No thanks. No job is worth that. I'll take my chances in the city. At least the only predators I gotta worry about here are the loan sharks. Hey, what do you know about loan sharks? Tell me. Who is that? Who are you? Both of you got fusili hair. Yeesh, my commute to Flotsam Vale's getting worse all the time. You ought to take a fish car. I heard it's pretty affordable. Sure, it used to be. They only kept prices low until they could run Crab Taxi out of business. And Crab Taxi was just a scheme by wealthy investors to take funding away from the scale rail. And the scale rail was only going to serve privileged neighborhoods in the first place. So screw it. I'll swim there myself if I have to. The public transport angle? I never would have expected. Just taking it one day at a time. Maybe one day I can afford to take it a whole week at a time. Not getting my hopes up, though. That's, that is fair. That is fair. Everyone calls me Krusty. Hey, Krusty, over here, Krusty. Yo, Krusty, how's it going? I'm so tired of it. I'm sorry you have to deal with all that name calling. That's the worst part. It's my my real name. <sighs> I didn't see any actual entrance to the prawn shop. No more discussion. I'm headed to Flotsam Vale, and that's that. Dad, you gotta quit that job. D don't you read the, didn't you read the studies? Working around all that gunk totally damages your brain. It's scientifically proven. A load of crap, if you ask me. If my brain was getting damaged, it'd have happened by now. <laughs> I've already been working for Shellfish Corp for, how many tides was it again? Oh my God. <laughs> this, this game is gonna hurt, like, hurt my brain. Oh, I'm always writing the again. <laughs> hey, buddy, you gotta get a load of my friend over here. This crab will tell you how things really are. He'll say the stuff we're all thinking in private, the kind of stuff the topsiders don't want you to hear, you hear? I don't like where this is going. This place sucks. <laughs> I didn't know they wrote Nisk Pattern as a crab. <laughs> <laughs> used to be I had a job up topside. Quick thing, helping some well-to-do family with some trash moving. There was a fine fella who seemed to take a shine into me. Sometimes I wonder what he's up to. Hey, buddy. Sorry, pal. No entry here right now. Still cleaning up the path after last trash day. I'll have it done soon. I promise. Can you really clean all this up by yourself? They'll fire me if I don't. So, yes. That's a, that's a lot of stuff, buddy. I bet you can climb this. This, this is this is a leg. This, this is a leg. I'm climbing a leg. <laughs> Do you think it's a lamp? Do you think the guy right down here is Jackson? The, the, the guy that she's pining after? Geb. You see this here? Best view in the lower crust. I'll be honest. It just looks like a stinky alleyway to me. Hey, I, the very stinkiest, brings a tear to one's eye, don't it? Don't it? The very stinkiest. Red car. Hey. Okay. Um, can I find that place I was looking for now? All right, we all know our roles. Lex, present. You'll go to work tonight tending bar at the Trash Day Gala. You'll be our ticket in. Uh, did I just stumble into a, a heist? You'll be our ticket in. Can't do. Get those upper crusters good and distracted while we slip in the worker's entrance. There, we'll split into two teams. Team A will be Lex, still present, and Hurst. Hello, darlings. While team two will consist of myself and Goggles. Hey, 
Team A is going to move through the fancy soiree until they find its host, the ludicrously trashy and trash-rich Jeffrey Crab III, and sweet-talk him into revealing the passcode to his family's safe. I doubt it'll put up much of a fight. Once he lets it slip, it will be on Team 2 to slip out the safe undetected and ride the scrap chute down to the bottom with our ill-begotten rewards. Team A will exit the party as its proper conclusion and reconvene in the morning. And Kodzi, your uncle, will be working up some wealthy shucking crab. Will be woken up as some wealthy shucking crabs. Incredible. Good luck with your heist, everybody. I, I hope it goes well. Okay. Careful where you walk down here, little one. These streets will chew you up as good as any predator. You gotta change your name, Lenny. No! Come on, change your name. I said no! Look, we can't be a percussionist trio named Binko, Banko, and Leonard. <laughs> I see no problems with the plan, Nomad. I hope it succeeds, and I hope they cut me a, a piece of it. <laughs> and why the shell not? We'd sound like a goddamn comedy trio. Well, maybe we should do that instead! I'm listening. <laughs> 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 They're changing their percussion trio into a, a comedy trio. I love it. Hey, kid. Hey, mister. Be sure to take care of yourself. I've seen too many good crabs let themselves waste away down here. They'll tell you no one gets polluted in the reef. But down here in the lower crust, it happens. It happens. Thanks. I'll be careful. I hope you have a real nice day. Oh, hello. It's actually uh, pretty pretty cool how much like good fun dialogue they have here. Hmm, not a lot of hermits left in the reef these days. Not really sure why. Any mass migrations I should know about? Beats me. I'm not really involved with the community. Sorry. Well, happy to meet you regardless. Keep safe, small fry. Usually when I'm in a situation like this, I just skip past all the dialogue, but I'm actually really enjoying all of this. Hey, little guy. I'm not that little. You think so? I'm pretty little, and you're even littler than little old me. Step out of the city and meet some real big guys, and you'll feel pretty little pretty quick. Where? I found the place that I needed to go accidentally, like immediately. And now I can't find it at all. <laughs> There's an item up there. If I could get to it. Oh, maybe I can maybe hop my way up. So if I scootily poot my way over here. Oh, there's the cool S. You see that? Somebody drew the cool S. Nice. Shipping label. First class package. Hold up. That looks like a, a real QR code. What do you think it goes to? Oh no. I'm scared. Can't load link. I just got coconut mauled. What? It sent me to a video that said I got coconut mauled. It's three years old. What the heck? Incredible. Moon Princess V, welcome back. How's it going? <laughs> I cannot stand how much I enjoy this. I would like to give the developers a nice little smooch on the cheek. Oh, there's the blacksmith over there. Ooh, I love your shell, little cutie. Uh, thanks, it's new. It doesn't really feel like me, though. Well, you wear it well in the meantime, sweetie. I'm sure you'll find the right shell for you eventually. I'll let you in on a little secret. 
If you ever find a shell you're real fond of, you can pay Shellfish Desires to insure it for you. That way, if it ever gets lost or damaged, they'll replace it for you, no questions asked. Whoa, that's actually pretty useful. Thanks, ma'am. Okay, that's one of the places I need to go. <laughs> that's the third time I've been hit by a car. Oh, here's the other one. Perfect. Ahoy there, traveler. Pull up a cork and stay a while. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I ain't seen you before, mister. You came to the right place. Mom's bar is super cool and popular. Hey, hey, hey. You a customer? You ought to talk to my mom. She's the one in charge. She's wearing an orange on her head. And a silica gel packet. <laughs> These little guys make my trips out to open ocean a little less lonely and a little more safe. What could a crab ask for, you know? Exceptional. Oh, shoot. No, I was not intentionally that. <laughs> My bad. That's what I get for not glancing at chat. Thank you so much, Bellarm. I appreciate it. While I was on face cam, I got hit by a car. In in the game. For the, for the record, in the game. Hello there, youngin. Welcome to Bottom Feeders. Finest little watering hole this side of the slurry. Hi, Um, my name's Krill. I'm new to town, I guess. Thought I recognized a fresh face. Please just plastic to meet you, Krill. Name's Nemma. If you've got the money, why not stop in for a bite? My kiddos and I would love to have you. We also offer a stowaway hiring service if you're interested in such a thing. Okay. Uh, what's a stowaway? You mentioned something about stowaways? What are those? I have stowaways. Oh, I'm sure you've seen them around. That's our nickname for any sort of little fella that sticks itself to your shell, little fella. Oh, like a barnacle? Exactly, and for the right place, there's all sorts of them that might tag along. People pay for that? Again, Krill, we are not shaming people. They sure do, hun. Lots of our visitors here are travelers just stopping by who could use a little company on the road. This, <laughs> they know how this sounds. <laughs> you ought to consider it if you've got a journey ahead of you. The open ocean can get mighty lonely, hun. I'll think about it. Thanks, ma'am. Uh, call me Nemma, hun. I'm not a crabby old lady just yet. Oh, increased stowaway capacity is really, really nice. Shell? Hey, um, if it's not too much of a bother, I'm looking for a shark that took my shell. Any chance he stopped by here? Barely sure I'd remember a fellow like that swimming into my establishment. Sorry, kiddo. That's okay. <laughs> no worries. 2,500 to increase. That, I mean, that's pretty good. I can get a packing pe or a razor blade. Oh my goodness. It increases your attack speed? High indestructible metal ring. I can just get a lamprey? Yucky. Or a fruit sticker. <laughs> Welk plus. A sinker? Hardly know her. I can get five other crabs. Okie doke. Uh, last place to go. Didn't I already talk to you? Living on the bottom is bad enough, but listening to the bang, bang, banging of that crusty old blacksmith is going to drive me shucking insane. Sorry, boo boo. Wait, is that a walrus? Oh, no, no, he's, he's just a different kind of crab. Is that a king crab? Living by the square lets me visit topside almost three times a week. It's almost like I'm a real topsider. All right, let's go talk to the guy we're supposed to talk to. He's got lots of stuff. <laughs> I like his mustache. Oi there, scrap. It's a fine piece of metal in your claws there. Lots of promise. Care to make it shine with me, scrap? Have you seen my shell? I almost don't want to ask, but did a big jerk shark come here trying to sell a shell for scrap? It would have probably seemed crazy to you because the shell was super gorgeous and cool. Aye, he came by. Turned that shell to scrap as soon as I could. Aww. What? Are you serious? Sure as seafoam I am. Nay, wait, you said a shark? Scrap that, my mistake, no sharks came by, nay. Oh. The boy, I've never seen Spirited Away, believe it or not. He's given me scuba, or scuba Stev vibes from uh, Star Wars Jedi Survivor. <laughs> I, that, so Spirited Away is a, a Studio Ghibli one, right? I've, I've never watched any of those. I'm a bad man. What did you think I said? You almost gave me a heart attack. No need to shout, Scrap. Me ears work just fine. 
Make it shine? You mean my fork? This is just some piece of junk I found in my neighborhood. Aye, and what a piece of junk it is, Scrap. Bring this old smith some relics he can break down, and he'll show you what that junk of yours can truly do. Sounds useful. Upgrade fork. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got a key. Upgrade my fork, Dad. Plus five attack. Okay, all right. I need more. Okay, so I need two more. <laughs> I gotta get cultured. Well, Goop Troop movie night is next Thursday, which reminds me I need to send Nisk another message about that. It, it's gotta be somewhere. I just gotta find where that shark went. This city is so big, how am I ever gonna find my shell? This place is so stupid and it's loud. Why couldn't everyone just leave me alone? Everywhere I turn, someone's trying to take something away from me or sell me some kind of scuttle right up, fellow citizens. <laughs> His name is Pronathan. Ladies and gentlemen, Pronathan. It's the grand opening of the prawn shop full of legitimate shallows made wares. We got plastics, we got metals, we got packing foam. We got garbage you ain't even heard of yet. What the? Is he wearing my shell as a hat? I'm gonna go beat this man up. I'm gonna go beat his, I mean, uh, negotiate. The, that's my shell! Are you serious? This guy's still following me? All right, play it cool. I don't know what you're talking about. Seriously, give that back. It was stolen from me by a jerk shark. Well, first off, that shark seemed super cool and chill to me. Second of all, he uh, sold it to me fair and square. You want it back? You gotta buy it like everything else in the store. That's how the prawn shop works, baby. Well, how much and uh, what can I actually pay with? Depends what you got, pal. I've got a few microplastics, I guess, and some string. Look, that shell's really important to me. Pronathan, all my homies love Pronathan. <laughs> Could I work for it or something? I'll do anything. Anything, huh? Yeah, I guess I could probably come up with some arduous and meaningless time sinks for you to partake in and earn your shell back. For starters, why don't you scrape the barnacles off my sweaty... Wait, wait, did you hear that? Hear what? Belay this conversation, kid. Trash Island is here. This always catches me off guard. I gotta get ready before I miss out on some prime plastics. Hey, I'm not done talking to you. It's time. To do 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 do. Trash day! It's trash day! Everyone get your baskets! Don't miss out! Oh boy, it's just it's just fallen from the sky, huh? Fight, fight, fight. Oh, there's our crypto bro friend. Oh. <laughs> Captain Clawbeard's glorified crunch. I've never seen anything like it. It's a message from the captain. It's got his face right on it. It's gotta be. Excuse me. Excuse me, please. Pardon me. Excuse me, young lady. As new Cassinia's official historian, I'm sure I can shed some light on... My God! If I'm not mistaken, this is part of a map. Oh, my God. A map showing the way to a most valuable treasure, I say. If someone were to find Incredible. its missing pieces and decipher them, why, they'd be rich beyond their wildest dreams, I say. Rich? I like the sound of that. That treasure's as good as mine. I'll be able to afford the flashy shell in the ocean, you know? Not if I get there first. Think of all the tourists that treasure can bring to our city. Well, don't you count out us, bottom siders. You'll be eating your hat when I get that treasure and fix up my restaurant. Oh, it's a race. It's it a rat appear, race. The hunt is hard, it's a I crab say. race. The first stop on the map seems to be the forest to the north of here. May <laughs> the best, crab. <gasps> Apologies for the interruption, folks. Oh, no. I seem to have misheard something. Oh, no. I could have almost sworn there were some citizens here planning on unearthing some valuables. Need I remind you all how threatening the ocean is outside this reef? I'd hope Why do I feel like he should be singing? Saying that the duty of such a dangerous expedition <laughs> would fall to the Shellfish Corporation. That would be safest for all involved. 
Don't you agree? Yeah, hear you, Roland. No, no problem. Then, as Shellfish Corp CEO in this fair city's de facto mayor... Oh, we love a de facto mayor. I suppose no one would have any objections to my taking sole control of this treasure hunt. Are we all in agreement? Oh, oh dear. I, I suppose that sounds all right with me, I say. <laughs> That's Mayor that Thomas Kinch. Sounds like some kind of crazy treasure hunt. Hey, kid. I just got an idea. If you can go get that treasure there, John, about, I'll gladly trade your shell for it. For, for real? You'd really do that? You bet. A prawn never goes back on his promise. I've heard that before. Uh, I've heard yeah! that before. I'm gonna find that treasure! Ha! <laughs> the gun is a party popper. Yeah, yeah you go, kid. Rowan can't tell us what to do. That treasure belongs to whoever can find it first. The corporations don't control us! He's got... <laughs> He's got a, a I suppose a little shellfish cracker on the back of him. Is only fair. Uh, on his back. I hope you know what you just dove into, kid. See you in the open ocean, treasure hunters. <laughs> <laughs> he disappears in a cloud of squid ink. <laughs> The Pringle Twisty Hat is the guy who runs the museum. Dang, that was crazy with a capital Z. You really stepped, it, stepped in it now, kid. That squid that hangs around Roland doesn't think twice about disappearing people. Y you told me to. Hey, I recall merely making a suggestion, pal, but the offer still stands. If you can get me that treasure, the shell's all yours. Okay, well, where do I start? Weren't you listening to that old dude? It's off in the grove, way north of here. You've got a bit of a walk ahead of you. Great. Well, I guess I have no choice now. 300 calories per serving? <laughs> Wait, was there MSG2 on it? <laughs> I'll take a look. I'm on this treasure hunt whether I like it or not. Oh yeah, one more thing. If you find any other junk out there, I'll take it off your hands for some microplastics. Fair's fair. I mean, I'll sell you some junk that I got. Yeah, man. For sure, for sure, for sure. I don't want to sell that. But I could sell some things for some level ups. We're just gonna go ham on it. What junk can I buy? Ooh. I could buy two more stainless. Oh, I can only buy one. Okay, I should wait on that. Things are tasty as frick. Everyone loves them. Just a single bite makes me feel totally restored. Know what I'm saying? <laughs> I can buy my home for nine million, nine hundred ninety-nine million, nine hundred ninety-nine thousand, nine hundred ninety-nine microplastics. <laughs> this feels kind of unethical. <laughs> what? This will let you carry more barbed hooks at once. Ah. Welcome back, Shirley. Uh, we murdered the Duchess. We're on a treasure hunt now. Everybody's really upset about things. Just drifted into town and you're already making waves, kiddo. If it wasn't for you, we'd all have just rolled over and let Roland step all over us like usual. So, so we're all going after this treasure then? Seems like it. If that old timer who runs the museum ain't pulling our claws, whoever gets that treasure is gonna have some serious pull around town. But honestly, as long as someone gets someone gets it who ain't rolling, most of us will be darn pleased. Who is that guy anyway? Why does everyone hate him so much? Roland, only the CEO of Shellfish Corp, the largest trash scavenging operation out there. Besides what a few independent traders haul in with their own two claws, all trash that makes its way into New Carcinia goes through Roland. So he's got some deep pockets. Shellfish Corp owns most of the buildings in town by now and charges a pretty plastic for the privilege of living in them. Those of us down in the lower crust, you could say we ain't really fans of the way things are going. So taking him down a peg by waving some treasure in his face, I can think of a lot worse ways of spending a tide or two. But enough about Roland. We gotta make tracks towards that treasure. That museum curator told us to head towards the grove, right? I've been to the grove before. Meet me just out of town if you need a nudge in the right direction. <laughs> the mabuttage was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> WTF, earlier we had two sassies, now we've got two cableys? Huh? 
Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, this is gonna rule. A real chance to go up against my idol, Roland. Your idol? You like that guy? Of course I do, he's a business genius, you know? Roland came, in, came into this town with nothing, save the clothes on his back and a trash scavenging empire that goes back generations. <laughs> My god, I hate it. Roland came into this town with nothing, save the clothes on his back and a trash scavenging empire that goes back generations. The man was born on third base. This game, it don't miss. It don't miss. Cably broken and cably ate. I've, I've heard that. And he built that empire up into a somewhat bigger empire, all on his own. Why go after the treasure if you think he's so cool then? <laughs> you really don't know the first thing about business, kid. Sure, I respect Roland, but we're also in the same market, and that makes us rivals. The free market demands I do my best to one-up him. That's the spirit of healthy competition. I hate it here. Leaving the city in today's climate? How frightful. But if we all work together, I'm sure we can find that treasure and come back in one piece. One piece? We could build a new church with that kind of money. Our faithful will worship in the parking lot no more. We're doing some, some treasure hunting church planting? Heavens, what excitement! I'll be tagging along on your little treasure hunt. I simply must document it for all my followers. Who are followers? You know, followers, people who follow me around, just desperate to know what I'm up to. Do you mean to tell me you don't have any? I mean, honestly. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, a real life treasure hunt. This sort of thing you read, this is the sort of thing you read about in books at the Little Crablet, as a Little Crablet. We're at the part of the day where reading is hard. Spoiler alert, that's every part of the day. Worship in the parking lot no more was a lackluster album. That's fair, that's fair. Uh, they, it really got slammed. I don't think it deserved all of the criticism that it got, but like definitely most of it. Do you think we'll fight a shark or a bobbit worm or one of those horrendous monstrosities that live only in the deepest depths of the drain? I really hope not. All right, let's go. Let's do the thing. Oh, do I Do I want to level up? Yeah, I think I want to level up. Okay. Up our health a little bit, up our attack a lot. Rock and roller. To the Grove! <laughs> CND's nuts. Incredible. Roland owns most of the industry around here. There aren't many folks around brave enough to stand up to him. But you've really got us all fired up. He's gonna regret it if he thinks we're just a bunch of soft shells. So says I, Bartleby Shoals. See you later, Bartleby. Any Bluey fans in the chat? <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's do this thing. Oh boy, everybody's here. There's so much talking. I just want to fight things. Welcome to Carcinia Heights. Luxury homes with luxury vi views for the luxurious upper crester yearning for a life of luxury. Homes start as low as 1.5 million microplastics. Wow, a real life treasure hunt right in our city. A tale of adventure, tragedy, betrayal, romance. Maybe if I hurry, I can snag the novelization rights. <clears throat> now that is capitalism. You aren't headed out to the open ocean to look for treasure? Shall no, I moved up here to avoid that sort of ruckus. Let all those clout chasers get themselves killed for all I care. Oh, I forgot I leveled up. I was like, I could go do some fashion. Hey, where'd you find that fork there? Oh, this thing? I just ran into it by the shore. I'll give you 3,000 microplastics for it right now. Uh, I'm sorry, it's not for sale. Come on, kid. I could use some good self-defense in a place like this. 6,000. I, I kind of need it, sorry. What, and leave a poor vulnerable crab like me on the current like that? 4,000. Wait, that went down from the last offer. Wait, you went down? I'm a haggler. <laughs> Watch out for hagglers, kids. Another one of those cardboard monstrosities just went up in our neighborhood. Gentrification, crab gentrification. In this economy, we had the decency to take these outcasts in, the least they could do is build some nicer looking buildings. Quite so. At this rate, our pristine ocean view is going to be blocked by hideous high density housing. And we all know who's to blame, the poor people. <laughs> 
The game is saying the quiet part out loud. The poor people, just so. <laughs> this game is everything that I hoped for and nothing that I expected. <laughs> is Urchin back yet? Still no sign of him. I told him heading out into the sands between was a bad idea. That boy in his get rich quick schemes. Sure hope he's doing all right. I wish I could have a little pet sardine. So cute. Oh my god, no way. What's up? I totally feel exactly the same way about sardines. No way. You want to kiss a little bit? <laughs> Everything I hoped for, but nothing I expect. That's cute. That's sweet. What? What? Huh? Huh? Mooch. Smooch! Smooch it out, boys. Smooch! All right. I think it's time to jump. Might as well. Come to the city, they said. It's safe inside the reef, they said. Fat lot of good if we can't even afford a place inside the walls. It's still better than staying out there with that beast out and about. Is it? What's stopping that thing from coming here anyway? What, you don't trust the, the scent markers? Have a little faith in technology. Have a little faith in technology. Howard's living his best life, or at least he's trying to. He's being bold, he's being brash. He does not belong in the trash. Well, he does belong in the trash, because trash is good here. A lot of talk about the end of the world these days. It's only a matter of time before whatever's gunking up, gunkin up crabs' minds out there comes to gunk us up too. Or, you know, so they say. Y'all figure that stuff is really true? Who gives a ship? If my rent doesn't go down soon, the world can go ahead and end as far as I'm concerned. So true, brother. Hey, brother. Whee! The sands between. Heck yeah, I've never been to the open ocean before. Enchanted Grove, here we come. All right, she said she knew where she was going. Whoa, 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 hold your seahorses, kiddo. Look, we're technically rivals in this treasure hunt thingamajig, but that don't mean I want to see you get devoured before my eyes. W what did I do wrong? Look, there's rules to explore on the sands between, namely steps you got to take from pre preventing him from slurping you right out of your shell and eating you whole. See these arches? Folks who commute from here have done a pretty good job of scenting routes to the nearby areas. Scenting? Yep, laying down scents that he ain't a fan of. No matter how tasty you are, he won't pass near the path. Wait, who are we talking about? Who is this guy? Look, just stick to the arches, okay, kiddo? And if you get chased, make your way back to one as quick as you can. C can do! Hi, Dad. So, you're serious about this treasure hunt after all? Of course I am. This is my only way to get my shell back. Please don't take offense, but I half suspected you'd lose your nerve, I say. The sands between are no place for an innocent crab. <laughs> Whatever. I'm super brave. Let's just get this over with so I can go home. Point me in the right direction. Oh, -ho! you might have what it takes after all, child. Such a willingness to run off and get killed in the name of discovery. It brings a tear to my eye, I say. Since you're new here, I'll give you an overview. To our north is the Enchanted Grove, once a reclusive village of spiritualists. East of here is Flotsam Vale, the company town of Shellfish Corp. And west? I wouldn't go west without a good reason. Not that it matters, the captain's map has pointed us north, towards the Enchanted Grove. Meet me there and we can discuss our next steps. Yes, sir! Okay. I'm worried. I don't see where the next arch is. Hello. Get the claw! Ow. <laughs> the sound of him hitting my tennis ball is fantastic. Oh, I tried to parry. It did not work. These guys have a different fish hook on their head. Why can I not stay focused on him? Chill out. Fish boy. Okay, I'm gonna take this shot class. And I'm gonna go die and get that item. No, I'm not. Pagoras the Ravenous. Well, I think we found him. I kind of want that item though. <laughs> the sound 
sound of him hitting my ball is fantastic. I mean, you're not wrong. It is. Oh, I see the other arch. Okay, that makes sense. Oi, Krabby. Uh, and I cannot stress this enough. Chow. That's a new uh, shell for me there. New shell discovered. Drunken Claw. What did that do for me? What does Drunken Claw do? I've got some kind of power up. Lovely. Okay, the the them using the reflection on the buoys, like the um the ring buoys, is actually really smart. <laughs> Aw, y'all are cute. I want to go golfing. What if my stream tomorrow is just me golfing? <laughs> Lovely. That was a decent fight. Still going to heal up after it. There's a seahorse over here. But I'm not nearly as worried about it now that there's not like... Uh-oh. Just so much uh, platforming to do. I think this is the way I'm supposed to go. GoPro golf cam? I So I streamed last year a, a game of golf featuring myself and T and KV Nashke. It was a very good time. I did it on my phone. Uh-oh. That's very bad for me. Don't die, Goop. Oh, heck. Oh, oh, heck. <laughs> Dag nab it. I streamed it via my phone last time, and the, the only issue I really had was that my connection did drop a couple of times, which was kind of expected. I do think I have a new phone since then, so that probably wouldn't be as much of an uh, issue. Um, but that the... Uh, the wind would be really bad. So like if I'm gonna do it again, I think I would probably want to acquire a um, Like a microphone with a windscreen on it that I can hook up to my phone That's definitely attached to a bad guy um, Is there there's a bottle cap over here Will I get attacked by him though? Yes. Oh boy. He's yucky. See you later. There we go. And I'll take your shot glass, thank you. And I'll fight this guy. Wait. Oh, this is a new one. It's a probiotic. Ya cult. What does the probiotic do for me? I don't know, but I'm so interested to find out. You there, fight me. Goodbye. A micro fluffy. That's what they call them, I believe. Oh, it heals me. Incredible. I actually, I'm so excited about this. Oh, 
Oh no! That was the thing that was healing me. You are so heckin' rude. I think this one increases my attack. I feel like I was doing more there. I'll keep it for now. I know that there are, like... <sighs> I know that there are, like, decent cell phone mics that you can get, like, for relatively cheap. Oh, come on, no! Oh, stab attacks! This is my bane, the bane of my existence in Dark Souls 2. And uh, it remains that way, it seems. <laughs> oh, there were actually two D cups. Can you do another one, Bellarm? <laughs> Micro Fluffy was your nickname in high school? I don't remember that, but I'm not going to call you a liar. I would never. I would never. Thanks, Bellarm. I'm going to go get that probiotic. Me in real life, actually. I was wondering what his range was. All right, back to the fight. Get lost. That felt very good. That felt very good. Goodbye. Oh, there's an item over here. Wee. Yeah, the guys with the olives, they hit like trucks. And they have a very fast attack pattern. Gonna break my shell. Never mind. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and use my power heal here and heal up and then swap into this guy. Technically, no, no, no. No, no, no. They hit like trucks. You ever been hit by a crab? You'd be surprised. What? Look at that. He broke that like heavy shell in like two heads. That is outrageous. Going back to this one. Come here, crab boy. Fight me like a real crab. Yeah, it doesn't feel so good to get stabbed now, does it? <laughs> there was a red solo cup back there. And it did fill me up. I guess this one doesn't have too much uh, defense if you're not using the ability. There's somebody over there. That's what's terrifying to me is that it pulled focus on somebody that I could not see. Oh. Fish, we both need to get out of here. Oh my god. Yeah, <laughs> he got donked by... Get clawed. Oh, he did not get clawed hard enough. Woo, there we go. Okay, all right, we're doing just fine. We're doing just fine. Oh, I think I want the Sriracha bottle cap more. Woo! Okay, uh, continue following where we're supposed to go. Ha 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 ha. 
Oh my god, leave me alone. I did not ask for this. Oh my god! Not being so spooky. You son of a gun! No! Oh, I was stuck against the thing! Arr. How do I unsubscribe from other crabs? I would I would like to unsubscribe from other crabs. Holy moly. It's called a lifesaver. It's called a ring buoy. <laughs> You know, I did used to be a certified lifeguard. Actually, several times in my life I've been a certified lifeguard. Right now, though, uh, no. No certifications. You gotta report a fishing attempt. Oof. God, these, these guys just hit so freaking hard. I cannot get the parry timing on that stupid attack. Look at how good he is at that. He almost killed me there. <laughs> I'd be so upset. <laughs> there we go. Okay, at least I get the heal from the probiotic bottle. <laughs> okay, I don't think I need to fight that guy. Uh, maybe I do. Easy enough. Easy enough. This guy is going to wreck me. He just dodged? Excuse me? They've never done that before. <laughs> Folks giving uh, respect to each other for their terrible dad jokes in chat. Uh, both somehow infuriates me and warms my heart at the same time. So like really well done y'all. I'm very impressed. Okay. If I can just get two heavy attacks on these guys before they attack me, that might be the like way to do it. I guess extremely pleased, exceptionally angry, somehow both and thrilled about it. Okay, that worked out. All right, fish part two. Okay, heavy attacks seem really kind of broken in this, honestly. I'm I'm here for it. The music here is really tense. It's like so understated, and <laughs> it makes me nervous. I still want to know what the big cubes are for. Because we've seen a few of those. Ha ha ha! Get wrecked, Olive Boy! Ho ha! I'm shocked that I have kept this probiotic bottle for this long. Oh, can I hit that without the guy coming and getting me? Lovely. We love to see it. My family is now clustered around a screen watching you play. Hi, family. <laughs> Hi, Cableys. <laughs> Cableys accoutrement. Oh, beautiful, lovely, beautiful. Don't go too far out, Goop. Stick to the rivers and the streams that you're used to. Sometimes if you can get a sneak attack on these, things go really well. Ah, there goes my shell. Okay, I gotta run. Uh, I'll take a soda can. 
Right, get in this can. Get in the can, Goop. Yeah! Oh my goodness. There we go. <laughs> I was about to be so mad about that. Okay. We're farther than we've ever been. We love that. Another instance where others fail, but in fact, the soda can't. You're right. Another instance where I hate that you're right, but you are so right. Ooh. Here's an idea. What if I mess with my stowaways? Do I have any that give big damage? Shell spell damage. That's pretty nice. My uh, the extra health would be probably pretty nice. I could just make myself real chonky. I've, I've got everything keyed into it to big attacks. So that's fine, I guess. I want to fight this fish before I... Well, okay, I guess we'll fight the puffer first. Ah, oh, I got the... Oh, no! This is exactly what I wanted to avoid! Uh, I'm gonna attract the big scary guy. No, run! Nope, don't run that way. Run this way. Oh, thimble, thimble, yeah, 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 thimble. Go with that. We can fortify, get ourselves a little bit chonkier, and then fight these guys. Can I just please aggro the fish before the puffer? Yes, that's what I wanted. There we go, okay. All right, if I could find another probiotic bottle, life would be swanky. Oh, okay. I would make another joke, but it's slightly inappropriate and Cabley's kids are watching. <laughs> you know Cabley? Ha ha ha! How are you staying under the B floor? Oh my goodness. That was unfair. It worked out. It worked out. Mo mostly it worked out. We got a chip claw. What is that? Oh, a tin can. We haven't seen a tin can in a while. Tin can's got shell shock. Shell shock's pretty fun. Can I fight you one at a time, please? Come here. No, that's not here. Whoa. I th that's got to be the grove, right? Hey. Oh my goodness, did they just both notice me at the same time? Oh, I accidentally got one. No, no, no. I don't have any juice. I'm fine, everything's fine. I've never been stressed. Never worried, never stressed. Five health, doing fine. Oh wait, <laughs> I didn't know I could run. <laughs> wait, this is tech. <laughs> I didn't know I could I could run into a into a roll. That's hysterical. Okay, there's a there's a rest point, a shell up there. But what's gonna jump out at me before then? You know? Something that's gonna one-shot me because I have half of one health left. I'm gonna fortify. Please let me be okay. I'm just gonna sprint it. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know who that is. I don't wanna know. Ooh! We did it! We made it through! Incredible! I'm incredible!
It's unlikely that, that they would be able to read it, and I also appreciate your thoughtfulness. This is, this is very nice. That, that is very nice. Okay. We're back on our BS. Let's go talk to this person, whoever they are. Hi. You again, Vagabond. I am pleased you survived. Chitin, have I talked to you before? Whoa, I barely recognized you. You're the guard from Slacktide, right? Nice hat. Oh. Indeed, Chitin is my name. However, I have shed my title. I was foolish to pledge my sword to a lord so easily swayed by greed. <laughs> Monsieur, incredible, incredible. Are you bomb voyage, sick to death of logic? Be honest, be honest. Are, have you been bomb voyage this whole time? I was foolish to pledge my sword to a lord so easily swayed by greed. You understand, don't you? The consequences of the fall of Slacktide. No one to guard the bridge? Far more serious, Vagabond. What annihilated Slacktide was an infection. At first, I thought it was a pollution of the body. Now I suspect it stems from the mind. Regardless, I believe it was the Duchess's greed that invited it into her lands. And until those like her are annihilated, the infection will spread and spread and spread. I cannot say we oui or no to that. <laughs> I'm watching you. For this purpose, I have arrived at this grove. Lovely. <laughs> you got Cably to snort? Sheesh. That's how you know the jokes are good. A wild Goopymon appeared. It's a Milkafu. Is this? I'm not gonna ask. Yo, Moon Princess V, congrats on your first Goopymon. Ugh. Every time somebody gets their first Goopymon, it brings joy to my heart in ways that I've never expected. Nomad, thank you for redeeming a stretch. Let's do that. Let's do that immediately. Oh, thank you again for redeeming that, Nomad. That was very good. Okay. Well, grab that. We need it. Let us continue onward and upward. Oh, these are all just dead crabs. This dude's been fighting. Way to go. <laughs> uh, after six hours, six-ish hours, BBGB re-greets people. So, so you know. With enough determination and practice, even a fish can learn to drive a car. Well, that's true. We did see that earlier. All right. Let's get into some frustrating platforming. Oh, item. Barbed hook. Yvetek says, you told me she was a good girl, but I didn't she realize, realize she was a good, good girl. She really is. What a sweetheart your cat is, Sister K. Oh, look, we already found our next, uh, our next save point. Hey, look who it is. Honestly thought you might have died in the sands between, you know? I would never. I would never have died there. Definitely not like five times. N -n no way, I'm pretty strong. I like your confidence, pal. And at the very least, you've made it this far. But stuff's gonna get rougher from here, you know? The Grove used to be a real chill village full of lov lovable country bumpkins. Real salt of the sea types. <laughs> But anyone who gets the paper knows what happened here by now. Just 10 or 20 tides ago, a bunch of them went totally nuts. Foaming at the mouth saying all kinds of wild stuff. And wouldn't you know it, those crazy crabs up and killed all the rest of them. Th that's horrible. Ah, uh, don't lose too much sleep over it. Happens all the time these days. That, that seems really bad. <laughs> yeah, it's not great. But what can you do, you know? That's life in the sticks. I just count myself lucky for my cozy apartment in New Carcinia, where nothing like that ever happens. I just heard my eighth grade English teacher shouting, foreshadowing. <laughs> they do have little aquariums on wheels that can be driven by the fish. Ah, I remember seeing, um, uh, you remember Twitch Plays Pokemon? I remember right after that, somebody made Fish Plays Pokemon, wherein wherever it was located, in the, they pointed a camera at the 
at the aquarium and then wherever it was located like each region of the tank was a different button that it would push i have no i doubt it ever finished but it was very funny to watch for a little while that's very uh very janet of you sister k <laughs> from from the good place to be clear not janet van dyne from uh ant-man and the wasp Well, it was fun, too, because it wasn't just, like, it wasn't just aquarium. It was, like, aquarium with purpose. It was just one fish, but still good. Still enjoyed it. <laughs> I had a feeling you knew which Janet. Ugh. Another. Yeah! There's the good repost. Oh, what? What have we said about ranged opponents? They're cheating. <laughs> he got me, but I got him back. I tell you what. Sinker, a heavyweight capable of dragging trash and creatures alike down to the depths. Attack steal plus 20 balance damage. 21 attack required. All right. Okay, who is shooting at me from up there? That dude. What a dork. What a nerd. What a rude dude. My shell's almost broken. I'm gonna wait until it, until it breaks. What are these? Okay. Luckily, they're not the the chonkier crabs. Get a lot of stuff here, though. You telling me a shrimp fried this rice? <laughs> You know, that is one of the things that I have come around to a little bit more since I uh, became married, was fried rice. I was really not a fried rice eater before, but now. <gasps> this is an ice cream cone. But now this is an ice cream cone. Believe it or not. Oh, okay, that's the guy who shoots arrows. Love that for me. I'm gonna go ahead and eat something. Range guy, you better be easy to kill. Thank you. If he would have been really tough to kill, I would have been so sad. Neato. We'll take it. Get my little crystal. Bump up my skills. Break this glass bottle. I, I would eat rice that was fried by a shrimp. I would. I would. I'm a novel gentleman like that. <gasps> is that a probiotic bottle? Yes, it is. I love that. Big fan of a thing. Oh, this has... Well, now I want it. Just so I can use its ability. <laughs> Heal myself up. Okay, how do I get up there? How do I get up there to murder that guy? He's made my list. He jumps. He jumps when he shoots. Just to make sure he really gets me. Okay, it looks like I gotta go up there. Ow, I, I was not looking where I was going. <laughs> there was a puppy in the vet lobby that I was worried Leah would be scared of, but she gave him a cold look like, I can take you easy. <laughs> Leah said, I've been around the block. I'm not afraid of you, punk. Oh, I forgot I have the, like, run, run stab attack. I don't, I don't love that. I got the timing so wrong on it. All right, heal up a little bit. Go back and get this item. Save the cheerleader, save the world. Do I make that reference too much? Be honest, be brutal. How doth one get over there? Oh, I see, there's a, there's a hook. But on the other side, it looks like. 
Hmm. Perm. There's a crab up there that can shoot me. There's a hook. Cause the hook brings you back. What? <laughs> that is a thousand percent on me. I did not press the jump button. I ain't telling you no lie. <gasps> what? He just pushed me. He just. He literally just walked at me so that I fell off the edge. What a jerk! I've got at least a quarter of a pound on you, kid. Tell him. Get him. Oh my god, his bow and arrow is a, an elastic band and a toothpick, I think? A cocktail toothpick? Oh, I didn't have... I was fighting that guy without a... Without a shell. I was living on the edge, I tell you what. Okay. Where? Barnacle. Oh, this is a colander. Oh, these guys suck. I'm dead. I am dead. I die here. Yep. Oh. This is a weird way to be dead, but I promise you I am. I know I look healthy and alive and whatnot, but and there's definitely a cocktail toothpick sticking out of my chest. I don't know if anyone else has noticed that, but here we are. Oh, I can do that. The music does, does become ominous at times. Come here, bucko. Yeah, get reposted, baby. Bonk. All right, arrow boy. What you got? What you got? What you know about claws? Oh, you got a friend? Stop it. Stop it right now. Rude. So rude. I don't have any heals left. And that dude is still shooting, shooting, shooting at me. He might still be able to get me here. Okay. I don't know where my souls are. My souls? My plastics. That's a seahorse. That's not where I was. Oh, Blodrick, have a great walk. I have no... No clue. How to get up there. I'm, I'm so confused on where where I was. There are so many. So many shells over here. Fascinating. Okay, you're gone. You're a jerk. Oh, that's ooze. I thought it was just normal land. I'm fine. Everything? Fine. You may not believe it, but this is what fine looks like. No man, nice catch on that Carawan. Carawan. Good work. I've got that Fitbit butt again. Do your Fitbits flash like this? 
Can you break a wall? What wall? The fourth wall? Perhaps. If I try really hard. Oh, there's a heal. Perfect. As long as I don't get snucked up on. Crunch that immediately. Is this a K cup? It is. It's a K cup. <laughs> I've got a K cup on my butt. The thing that checks your heart rate? Oh, mine doesn't do that. Oh, you mean like the underside of it. I see what you mean. I understand. Oh! Remember when I said, as long as something doesn't sneak up on me. Ooh, well, that sucks. I'm dead. I am 50 shades of dead. And I can't leave? I have to die in this fight. I can't. Oh, I... Yeah. Interesting attack, that. Excuse me? And there it is. <laughs> there go all my microplastics. Not a cake cup, a K-cup, like a Keurig. There was a wall near the beginning that was mildly glowing and had a swirl. Oh, you mean the big cube things. Yeah, I don't know what to do with those. I can't like break them or do anything to them, so I've got no clue. Can I leave? Without fighting him. I think I can, which is very good for us. <laughs> Cake cup is funnier, but it is not what I said. Aha! <laughs> when I'm all sauced up, this is a lot easier, it turns out. Okay, uh, well, I mean, I guess there's no reason for me to not fight this guy. I'll just die again. There go all my microplastics. Oh, there's another... Um, another heart plant. <laughs> he killed his own little dude. Let me go ahead and eat. Have this one. Crabs, 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 crabs. I don't even crabs, know what this crabs, thing is. Crabs, 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 crabs. Oyster shells, oyster shells. Quabs, quabs, I assume that was Ash. Nope. Back it up, goop. Okay. Everything's fine. Oh, that was a good dodge. Oh, no, that one's... Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Keep trying to uh, repost him. <laughs> he, he keeps dropping his little dudes. <laughs> and so <laughs> literally every time he kills his own little guy. Okay. <laughs> he got hit by all the bubbles in the air. Bubbles! <laughs> Bro.
Huh? Oh, 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 that's bad. That's bad. Okay, we lived. Good job, us. Hit him with the claw! Yeah! The claw worked! Pollution scoured. Let's go! Ash, thank you again for those 12 quad biddies. I appreciate it so much. You're goop famous. <laughs> A little wah! Got slappy. Got slappy. Nice. Red Zero, thank you for the five nice got slappy biddies. I appreciate that so much. Let's go pick this up. Ah, uh, that's probably where I need to go. That guy's gonna shoot me. Probably where I need to go, but it's not where I'm gonna go right now. Um, I like you. No, man, thank you for the seven I like you biddies. I like you too, I appreciate that. Y'all are so nice to me. I'm gonna try to like sneak our way through here. You gonna come over here? There we go. I'm just trying to work my way back towards the, um, the shell, which is this direction. Oh, lovely. It's literally right in front of me. Perfection. Exceptional. Okay, a little bit of heal up. Oh, a little bit of level up. I think we go higher attack still. Although higher MSG may be worth it. Let's do it. Let's increase our monosodium glutamate. Rock and roll. Okay, this game rips. For real, for real. People told me they were like, we we saw. Oh, did I try the claw on the wall? That's a good idea. I did not, but I should. That'll have to be a next time thing. But when we saw this, I was like, oh, this is very funny and very like, what a novel idea. And then people came back and were like, oh, but also it's good? Question mark. Uh, so that's pretty freaking poggy walkie. <laughs> I'm glad that it is. I'm gonna enjoy the crap out of this game. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me as we play it. Yeah, super delightful is how I would put it too. Holy schmoly. I, <laughs> I just had a great time. Just a great time the whole time. And like, it's it's challenging, it's fun, it has dark undertones, it's got this wild, like, really forward commentary on it about like pollution and capitalism and, and all of these different things. Like, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. You'll never guess, but I love it.